Good morning. Hey, good morning. Can everyone hear me or just you hear me? Is this just private Jesse time? I mean, everyone can hear you now. I don't, you know, although it could be private Jesse time, you know. <laughs> I am your easy lover. I can't believe how close those songs are. Every time I, there's got to be a remix or a rap song about it. It's so good. <laughs> it's so good. I would, I need to get mega ran. I need to call up and be like, yo, dude. I know you do various raps about things. What if we did a rap about Deadly Premonition using I, that beat? I wrote Deadly Premonition whistle song theme rap. I wrote that down already. It, there, that, that beat is so funky fresh. There's got to be something we could do with it. I wrote down we need to end our next Illuminati episode about this game with that, with the song. So it'd be great if I could get someone to make a rap song with the, I need to reach out to people. And that's how we have to end our episode. <laughs> and be like, let's all whistle and think about the good times. And, and just, then just some dope, and yeah, and then just some dope beats come in there. Absolutely. Yeah. That also, sounds... we gotta get uh, we gotta when get. I said Illuminati. I meant gentlemen's gaming club. Sorry, I don't know it's why. All... It's I don't fine. know why it's that was fine. on my head. It's all it's all there. Uh, we also gotta get Okra Boy T-shirts. <laughs> Okra Boy <laughs> is my favorite character. I I thought Hot Dog Hot Dog Man was gonna be good, but Okra Boy is just as good, if not better. He's super good. Okra Boy pointing down. He's like, hey, you want some of this? He's great. Yeah. Oh my goodness. All right, let me uh start up a whole meeting thing for you. Let's do everything so we can play this game. Let me get rid of this. Oh, shit. I forgot. <laughs> Scared the crap out of me. I forgot that's where yeah. we were. <laughs> yeah, we're right. Jesse, we're right in the shit of it right now. Yeah, I, we're right in the I, shit I, of it right can now. Can I tell you a thing? I'm not <laughs> sure. I'm not sure how much time we have left in this game. It could literally be 20 minutes for all I know. I have no idea oh. what we have left to do. Listen, don't. I couldn't. This game, I thought we were done and then we're not done. And then I don't know what's happening right now. Well, that's what happened in Twin Peaks too. They blow. They finished mid second season their big story arc, and then had to like get some other stuff. So maybe this is the other stuff. You think David Lynch did that on purpose? Uh, no. That that had to do with ABC. ABC didn't like the idea of Laura Palmer. The idea was that we would never know who killed Laura Palmer. Like that was supposed to be it, and ABC was like, "Uh, uh, you better put an end of that." So they like, uh, uh, he just like. They just like let the studio do it, and then you know, then you have a couple episodes where that dude's driving around on a bike and making out with that rich lady, and you're like, okay. Now, for some of you who are like, but Jesse, I don't, I don't see, I don't understand. Um, <laughs> what, what is what is Santel talking about? What about David Lynch, who doesn't at all ever, ever answer questions? Well, yeah. Well, gang, hold on, let me studio mode this so I don't screw it up. Window capture, perfect. Just, just perfect. Um, this is for all of you who missed my tweet yesterday. Just put this right here, right in the middle. This this man is definitely one of the reasons why this game exists, and uh, is definitely the the reason why we were all weirded out. And he influences my life in ways that I do not quite truly understand. But here we go. For you. Just a minute 15. Enjoy. If it works. Come on, internet. What? What? Oh, Santel. Oh, boy. I'm going to refresh. Come on, Internet. You can do this. Good morning. This is not too powerful. It's a minute 15. 29, 2020, and it's a Wednesday. For those of you experiencing this weather report audio only, you can't see that I'm holding a jar. What is the purpose of this jar? <laughs> <laughs> Why did I paint it this certain way? Here in LA, at early morning clouds and fog rolled in, but it's soon going to burn off. Very still right now, around 57 degrees Fahrenheit, 14 Celsius. 
Should be going up once again to the low 80s this afternoon, around 27 degrees Celsius. And we should, once this burns away, this gray burns away, we should be having a very beautiful day with blue skies and golden sunshine. Everyone, have a great day. That's the video. That is the most, that is the most perfect example of this game, of David Lynch, his, of all of it. His hair is so good. He's slowly becoming eraser head. He's that hair is so good. <laughs> Everyone's like, why do you point out the jar? That, my friends, is the point. <laughs> See, and that's why he will never explain why, it. And I feel like Deadly Premonition Two could are. The, all of the games could get away with less explanations of things. <laughs> You're right. Yeah, guys, we'll never know the mystery of that jar. Just that's what it is. Yeah, Welcome to it. There's no happen. answer for it. He will never answer it. If you've never seen David Lynch stuff, God help you. It, it David Lynch. What would you do? Where would you ask people to start with David Lynch? Like maybe like Blue Velvet? Like that's so like that's such a big that's such a big commitment to get into David Lynch. What was the one movie about? Yeah, Mulholland Drive is probably where I'd start. Mm. But you could also do his studio films. The eighties Dune is super fun. I he love did, that he movie. He did do Dune, that's true. Most and he did probably Elephant seen Man. Yeah. He did El but that's like a normal film. Like that's not him. That's like when Eraser you find out also that, uh, very good. That's like when you find out that Steven Sp uh, not Steven Spielberg, Stephen King wrote like uh Shawshank Redemption. Schindler. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And you're yeah, like, yeah. what? Um, I think it's hard to talk about David Lynch because David Lynch, <laughs> the most recent thing David Lynch made was a, was a 15 minute movie where he on Netflix, where he interviewed a like a, a monkey, and the <laughs> monkey so had voiceover, <laughs> and they were at like a restaurant. <laughs> And the monkey You're going away like, for a long time there, monkey. What do you have to say to that? Because apparently he killed his chicken girlfriend, but at the end, the chicken girlfriend... Sh like, it's crazy. Genuinely crazy. I will say that if you want a really quick summary of what um, David Lynch is, go look up... He made a song. It's like three minutes long. It's like, Johnny was a football player. <laughs> it's fucking crazy. <laughs> it's crazy. Um, yeah, basically David Lynch is what I imagine Crendor being in uh, 10 years. Oh boy, that's so fun. Yeah. <laughs> we gotta get, we gotta get a, a, a web camera on that guy. <laughs> yeah, I imagine that being the case. He is a, uh, yeah, David Lynch is a wild dude and I love, I love him. He's so strange, but his ideas are brilliant. Like, it's like, <laughs> he says in videos, he will say stuff like, um, you have to, the best ideas come from fishing the mind you have to catch mind fish and when you catch a mind fish and you eat the mind fish you get mind ideas that lay eggs and plant mind seeds and you're like what are you talking about but for some reason when you think about it you're like huh <laughs> like okay i guess he's yeah. kind of right he plays with expectations of scene structures and um He's got a lot of his a lot of his work is a critique on like American like suburbanism. Like sure. Twin Peaks and like Blue Velvet. It's always like these like oh, this is just small quaint town, but in reality it's like oh no, it's awful. There's a there's a seedy underbelly to everything, which is exactly what Deadly Premonition is. Deadly sure. Premonition is the entire point normal of the world. Is, yeah, the entire point of the mm -hmm. game is he's like, it's the deep south, Zach. It's a quaint, different place. I'm so happy to be here. And then the entire time it's like, this is the worst place ever. And he's like, what a great town. Yeah, it's all absurd. Uh-oh, my boy came into the wrong chat. Hold on, I gotta get him. Admit. Wow. Oh, today you look great. You don't look like you're not wearing a uh, Hawaiian shirt. No, I'm not wearing <laughs> I'm not wearing a Hawaiian shirt today. Hold on, let me, I got I got to mute, mute my, my Discord. There we go. You're not yeah, wearing just... a Hawaiian shirt at all. If anything, you are uh now you look like a like a like a dock shoreman. 
Yeah, I, listen, I work um, I work for Steve Zissou. We're actually, going on an adventure. Actually, you don't look like you work at a dock at all. You look like you're one of the 1960s Penguins henchmen. <laughs> <laughs> Come on, boss. Let's get the Batman. Yeah. My hair is my hair is so long that I get out of the shower, brush it, and then put a beanie on because I don't know what to, I don't know what to do with it, and I don't want to go outside. I'm scared of going I'm outside. I'm so glad I get to see you for like these very split seconds before you turn off your camera. It's... You could show everybody else me if you want. I don't buy. They can see my. Body That's a lot of work. Want. I'd have to Look like put that. a. I'd Look have to put that. a thing on you. Hold on. Do I have that? Be- <laughs> There's a lot no of work. way you have that feature. Hold no, on. We'll it's a lot. I can. I think I can do this. Hold on. How would I? Oh my god! I'm gonna use the sunfall cycle. Uh, <laughs> there you are. What you, I'm, what, I'm not what, gonna. What? I'm not even gonna try. I'm gonna use the sunfall cycle screen to. <laughs> Am I gonna look cool? What do I? He, there, look at me. Look at you me. Look like you, Hi, you look like you're a You look like you went and you're like gonna go get the Batman. It's very funny. Yeah, I, I can do. I can look like that. I can look like so many things. Uh, this is super fun. This is like my normal. This is my watching Jesse stream mode. But sometimes, yeah. you know, I want to be different things. Hey, everyone, did you ever know? Did you know what I would look like if I was? Uh, I don't know what's happening right now. Pickle. Oh my Pickle god. Santa. Oh no. Why do I have this? This is <laughs> what you're doing, Jesse. This is your life. Pickle Santa. <laughs> Uh-oh, uh-oh, let's, we're going to the ground. Look, now I'm a spud boy. Look at me, I'm a potato boy. I had no idea this whole time I've been a potato. And if you don't do good, you're not going to measure up to me, everybody, because I'm the king of the rulers. Why do you Why do you have this? Jesse, this is my life. This is what I do. I go to Zoom conferences, and I'm like, yo, I'm a llama. Let's do this. Why this do you life. have this? Yo, you just got to deal with it, bro. Lo, deal with it. I'm not doing anything. This is my life. This is what I do, bro. This is what I do. Oh, what is this? Yeah. You know what's good? You know what's good with a cup of coffee, Jesse? A piece of pie. Oh, yeah, I hate come this. On. Oh, Santel, I hate me. it. What do you mean? Oh, buddy. Do you, you know, this doesn't light your fire, Jesse? This oh, doesn't buddy, make the I content you want? Oh, I hate it. Oh, uh, you as a candle is even grosser. Oh, I hate this. <laughs> What if I'm like a cool pepper pig? Is this okay? Can I be There's like, hey, nothing. Jesse! <laughs> Jesse! I want to be your friend. Give me up. Give mama a kiss. There's nothing. I'm going to switch this screen. There's nothing good about this. There's, I'm okay. switching the screen. There's nothing. Okay. Okay. Wait, wait, okay. wait, wait. <laughs> uh, this, is, this is just normal. This is just normal, Jesse. This is absolutely what I look like. Come on. Let's get to the game. You're wasting time. Your mustache, your mustache is far too floppy for it to be real. This is a real <laughs> mustache. This is what I look like. This is what I've always looked like. Dr. Eggman. <laughs> <laughs> one day you'll yeah. get that damn hedgehog. I believe in you. Yeah, one day. One of these days. But today I'm just a dolphin boy. So let's go. Dive into the ocean of deadly premonition. Splash. <laughs> <laughs> That's the most, the most horrifying thing. Oh, uh, oh. <laughs> everything about the beginning of this video is now cursed. <laughs> everything. <laughs> Every last thing is cursed. <laughs> All right, let me close down my close down my filters. Here we go. Here we let me go. Close down my, let me shut down my other computer that's uh, all filters. Let me get uh let me turn off the filter machine. Okay. I just let's wanna go watch see. a full stream with Santel now. You mean the stream we're about to do? Yeah, we're th- welcome, this, welcome this to stream Deadly right Premonition. Now? Oh, I guess they mean they want me to stream. I I will think yeah, about it. I don't you know. Stream. It's, you're it's, already you're already better than I am. <laughs> Because I am fly- I can look like a banana and a pickle. I don't know. I don't know. Yeah, if that I've never even. I don't even know where I'd get those things. It's- <laughs> <laughs> okay, uh, oh. let's let's do this. Oh my god. Yeah, let's do this. Yeah. Oh, I f- I forgot. Here we are. <laughs> Here we are. Oh, I can't believe this is this is uh, this is it now. Question. This is uh, us. You- yeah. Do you want to catch up, everybody? That did, if they didn't see it yesterday, because we're we've basically solved the case. The case is over, basically. Yeah. So basically, where we left off is uh, last episode. York um, and CLG discovered that in the big barge that's sort of in, I guess it's not big, the garbage boat that's been going up and down the um, river. There was the reason it was being weighed down is because CLG's mom was in there and she was like, 
800 pounds, and she is being held there and force-fed seed goop yeah, by like, yeah. her husband, Melvin, the police officer. And Melvin was secretly in love with Leonard before Leonard left, right? Yes. Was in love with was in love with Professor R. So regardless well, that, that, of that's the thing is like this is the problem with this. It's tough to talk about this story because I don't want to like offensive be offensive at all. But the yeah. idea, but like the way the story tells it is that he fell in love with Leonard, and then when Leonard returned, having uh, transitioned to Lena, yes, then he was like, all right. I mean, I guess I can still love you. Right? I guess that's what they said. And uh, so he still was in love. But I think they were trying to imply that, that Melvin was gay at the beginning. I think that's what they're trying to imply. I don't know if it was that or some supernatural attraction. Because yeah, he know. said he was into Lena no matter what Lena wanted to do. He was willing to sacrifice and gaslit the big woman for eight years. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Basically, he went to Candy the most beautiful woman in town who was Lena's sister and was like, I want to be with the most beautiful woman in town. He seduced her. They got together. Um, but the truth is that the reasoning behind all of it was also because CLG, Patricia, was in fact the daughter of Lena and Galena. The, uh, the two sisters. Inc incestual child, yes, incestuous if you will. incestuous child. And she is like the pure blood of the family. Cursed blood, yeah. She's the cursed blood. And um, I, look, I'm trying, Fabimus. Look, I'm working on it. Um, okay. Anyway, so, since then, one hand guy has raised CLG, but now CLG is missing. And we uh, and the investigators are grilling York here in his bedroom because he has this weird ritual set up. Yeah, uh, if you, so the entire course of the game, there's been sort of uh, bookends that are going on where uh, this detective Aaliyah and this other guy who's just a big old, uh, you know, dork burger. Uh, dork burger. Uh, yeah, the pizza lover, pizza fetishist, we'll say. Mm -hmm. um, he is, uh, th they've been like talking with Zach, who as you know, if you play Deadly Permission, Zach is York. They're just a split personality. And... As apparently in Zach's bedroom, they discover that he has recreated the crime scenes of the past. So this right here would be uh, the first victim who was cut up, Lise, and he recreated where she was. And then he put inside of her, or I guess not inside of the stuffed up version, a rat that he discovered. Um, apparently the rats, rats have gotten into the seeds. And the seeds like sprout in the stomach of the rats, very much like how in the first game, seeds sprout in the belly of women. And did he say he did this to 57 rats or like, like, no, like 100, 100 some? He was like, like he kept 132 testing it. rats. Yeah. yeah, he has not been able to get this. He can get them to grow, but then he can't get them to do anything else. Yeah, he can't figure out exactly. Did he say 137? That's very funny. Um, So uh, the the idea is that he's like, something's missing. I can't figure out what is needed to make it grow the way it did before. Because if you remember in the very first Deadly Premonition, FK, he grows like red plants inside of women. Yeah, he says he has a special, there's a special technique to it. And I think we agreed that it's definitely like a little rapey, whatever it is. Uh-huh. Uh, because, you know, the things FK says, you're like, whoa, dude. So who knows? We will find out. Anyway, Morgan, and at this point in the game, Aaliyah and Simon are like, you know, we basically Patricia, older Patricia, because this is 2019 now, older Patricia, but got to be honest, this explanation is not helping. It's, it, look, I don't know how we would help you, <laughs> honestly. I don't know. If you think this sounds crazy, imagine playing the game. Yeah, th we chased a dog two days ago. Like, this is just par for the course. Literally, this we, is what's going on. Literally, we chased a dog for and like then chased a girl minutes. around. Yeah, and then we had to chase a girl around with great cardio. Yeah, it is. It's it's <laughs> she ran really far. 
Anyway, the little girl who was our friend back in 2005 is now an adult in 2019, obviously, but she's gone missing. And Avery, the guy who's basically of mice and menning this whole thing, he apparently kidnapped her. We don't know. And so Aaliyah and Simon are like, we got to find him. And York's like, or Zach is like, I can help you. And so now we're playing as Zach again, kind of. And we are looking at the things in our room. And that's sort of the catch up. Oh, okay. Also, there's a fairy flying around. You're right. Also, oh, there's a fairy. That <laughs> I forgot. That I saw, that Jesse didn't see, and that Jesse saw, and now we can all see the fairies. We're into Ooh, fairies, everyone. Clap yeah, to keep them I alive. Forgot there's fairies. Yeah, there's a fairy showed up. Okay. And Patricia resembled Lee so much that I once confused them for a moment. I have a lot of questions about that, too. Meaning it would yep. be no surprise if the same man went after Patricia. Right, Avery. But that's... Wasn't he at the very beginning? It, all right, again. Santel. Is this like Mad Max? Is the whole point going to be the Patricia Road Avery? Yes. I'm telling you, I think that's him? what it is. I think that's what it is. Can I tell you? I had this I had this thought the other day. So I started watching Snowpiercer. Uh, I recorded all of it on like there's a new show on TV, the Snow Oh like, yeah, the the, T the TBS one with um with Jennifer Conley. Yeah, and uh, the dude from Hamilton. Yes. Um so it's so I started watching it cuz I was like, all right, it, you know, I guess it's based less off the comics and more off the movie. I guess I don't know. It doesn't matter because I've seen both. So I'm like, okay. So I started I started watching it and um in it there I think maybe the third or fourth episode there like the first couple episodes there's a there's a a murder mystery plot. And the murder mystery plot to me very much echoes the murder mystery plot in this game. Mm. And so I was like, "Hold up now." So I wonder if it's going to end that way. I'm not going to spoil it for the show, but I'm very curious if it's going to end that way. I don't know. We'll see. Huh. All right, let's go. Why didn't I think of that until now? Uh, oh, yeah, I was trying to stall for time so I could get... There's our fairy. There's the fairy. There's our... My fairy part are bongos. Are right there. Yeah, the bongos we have. Oh, that's a nice uh, keepsake. Yeah. I believe the body was the next trigger, so we can do photo of Patricia. Well, let's just do the X first. Okay. A lot of times passed since I last saw Patricia. If I hadn't gone back to Lucare, she probably would have never been kidnapped. I dragged her back into her cursed destiny. There's that little fairy. Come on, give me something. I can't even use it here to like access them, huh? No. I hate that I have to wait for this eye. My heart. I'm going to try it. Maybe the fairy will trigger. Like, why can't I trigger the fairy? Why won't he be like, hmm, that's a damn fairy is what that is. <laughs> Maybe. I don't know. Although I love that it's a visual thing and he's not just like super crazy all the time. Yeah. 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 Or he's again, we don't even know if he's in his right mind in he that. Could we be don't controlled know. by FK. You're right. Right. All right. Our eye is almost there. Nothing. The photo of Patricia is the thing, huh? Okay. Okay. If your story is true, then why did Avery Smith kidnap Patricia? Patricia resembles Lise. I even got them confused once. And Lise reported being stalked by a 10-foot man. That's Avery Smith? Exactly. Wh why did we <laughs> consistently say he wasn't the one then? But he's only 6'7 at best. Exactly. His physical characteristics don't match the person you're talking about. Exactly. I once concluded the very same thing, but now I know. That was definitely Avery. He protected Lisa's body until you discovered his sleeping beauty. So after losing Lisa's body, he kidnapped Patricia as a replacement? Th that's ridiculous. Is that really what you think happened? Even if Avery did possess that sort of mentality, it doesn't make sense. If Lise was really that important to him, he would have tried to steal her back. Not now, maybe. But certainly after she was buried. 
Would you be able to go on worshipping a goddess who had been defiled by so many hands? That Ugh. ice was a barrier, a shield that separated the divine from our world. Cuckoo! Ugh, oh, yeah. Again, there's so many things left in this apartment that have not been answered, Santel. I know, and and where I don't think it makes me sad that the game is not going to delve into it because there's like, what's in those boxes? What other trinkets do we have from other cases? What, what else is in here? What are the damn symbol thing? Like the the places of power he has in his apartment? Right. Hey, Bill, your hypothesis was pretty much on the mark. Last week, I went back to Lucare. Then I bought a used car and got on a train in Trenton. But not for the reason you think. I wasn't stalking Patricia. And I'd never try to kidnap her. Then why would you go there? Why would you risk so much, especially since you knew that you were under surveillance? Bananas Fosters are my favorite. Once again, I'm chasing Saint Rouge. Saint Rouge? Even after I quit the FBI, I continued to study the red trees on my own. And now I've come to the conclusion that those red seeds and Saint Rouge both come from the same roots. Duh! I also found proof that someone's inherited the original recipe. Duh! That's why I flew to Lucare to confirm my suspicions. But right. I was more powerless than I ever could have imagined. I couldn't move like I used to. No badge, no gun. So skateboard after wandering aimlessly around town. I swallowed down my torment and my weakness and left. You expect me to believe that? I know you've got it in you. What's that supposed to mean? You found Lise Clarkson's body. The one thing I never did. And only a few days after discovering the body, you came to visit me. You should be fully capable of discerning that what I'm telling you is the truth. Talking much about oneself can also be a means to conceal oneself. You can't trick me. I, I wonder if he's going to explain the PowerPoints now. The man who built up the Clarkson Empire. He must have been able to withstand unfathomable pressure and accusations while constantly spilling human blood. The more I learned about him, the more I felt like he was completely beyond my reach. He possessed an impeccable mind. I can still remember that even now. When I first met P.J. Clarkson, how did I feel? I just thought, oh, so this is what it feels like to be in the presence of a truly powerful person. He had a very unique aura, as if he had surpassed the realm of good and evil. Uh-huh. <laughs> uh -huh. It's the kind of feeling you get when you come face to face with a legendary actor or an influential politician. He's Someone talking about Arnold S. To sense the deep darkness that trailed behind him. You're totally right. Politician and actor, Arnold S. That's Arnold S. That's Arnold S. The brighter the light, the darker the shadow. The more he shined, the more the people around him had to squint to shut out the light. The heat was just so intense that it forced people to shut up their hearts in order to keep from burning up. But Patricia was different. She greeted travelers with a warm embrace, like the real sun. I'm going to save her. Even if I need to walk through a bullet to get there. But for real, why is this story called a blessing in disguise, Santel? What is, what is the blessing? The Suspicious drum! Those are the drums you wanted. Uh, I don't That's know. That's the eerie drum that Pastor Tyrone gave to me. 
The pressed flower I took from the hotel bathroom is still right on top, and it hasn't even wilted. Maybe it really was blessed with some sort of holy power. Nah. That's also just a squirrel tail. Just like a yeah, full-on <laughs> squirrel's tail. <laughs> I don't... I feel like the Sunroos wrapper is the thing. I'm going to do this. Okay. What is this drum? Please don't tell me it was a tool they planned to use for the blood purge. Sharp eyes as usual, Belle. No. It was part of an even darker ritual. I can't even bring myself to say its name. It was far more important to our case. And far more horrible, if you can believe it. <laughs> what? <laughs> what? <laughs> no, that's just a drum. <laughs> a drum made from three empty cans, animal skins, and a fragrant pressed flower. Like I said, what is it? Maybe it's a souvenir? What? You expect me to believe that? Can I ask you a question? We did all that fucking work and it's just a drum. It's just a silly drum that he just brings him memories. It brings him joyous memories back to his brain. Oh, never mind. I was going to say, I thought that that was going to... That was a quest we had to do, right? We yes. Were forced, all right. I thought, oh, was that a side quest we did? And if we did all the side quests, we have other things in this room, but that was a quest we had to do. That was so the main mind. quest. Yeah. Yeah. What's sad is that the character just laughed at her in, in, in when, when we asked about the drum. Like, that thing you wanted to know about, Jesse? Nope, it's just some drums. Just some silly drums we did. Yeah, we went on a whole quest. <laughs> and it's just drums, dummy. It's just drums. <laughs> Avery showered me with key words. Smarty pants scientist, research, and lab. Why didn't I pick up on any of it? If shallow prejudice is what prevented me from taking his words seriously... And I truly am a failure as an agent. No. I know why. I was still immature as a human being. Huh. You said that someone inherited the Saint Rouge recipe, didn't you? Is that someone Avery Smith? It has to be. Avery used to help Professor R do research in secret. What? Well, that wasn't in the report. I only realized it just now, the moment I spilled my coffee on the floor. Avery revealed that he was helping with some sort of research. <sighs> but at the time, I let his confession go in one ear and out the other. Now that I look back on it, I realize it was solid proof that he was helping her produce Saint Rouge. What makes you think that? He had free access to the deepest parts of the cold storage warehouse. Oh. Wait. Uh, meaning... Saint Rouge needs to be produced in an extremely cold environment. Exactly. Aaliyah Davis. You already considered this possibility, didn't you? That's why you investigated the cold storage warehouse as soon as you got to Lucare, in order to locate where Saint Rouge was being made. Then, you came across Lisa's body by pure chance. Um, yeah. Is Avery going to pull, and I won't say the end of the movie, but is it sort of like the usual suspects? Are we going to find out I was thinking the same thing. I was like, I don't want to spoil it. I'm like, eh, I know where you're going with this. Or that, or that movie Great with, question. um... Or that movie with um, uh, where the where they heist, where he plays he he plays the special needs janitor, and then he turns out he's the mastermind all along. What's that movie? Oh, I don't uh, know. With Robert De Niro, and it has uh, the guy from Fight Club in it. What? Uh, that's fine. It's fine. Ed it's fine. Uh, yeah, Ed Norton's in it, and Ed Norton plays this like he like. Play, pretends to be a janitor with special needs, but then it turns out he just robs the whole place. 
Huh. Brando's in the movie. The score. Thank you. Thank you, uh, uh, Bar Bark Doll. The score. It's crazy. Oh, and he did it in Primal Fear. Ooh, weird. The man knows what he likes. All right, L. <laughs> yeah. All right. It's her. It's two things. Let's go Greenville then. Great. The Greenville case. It awoke me. And also stole my irreplaceable best friend from me. Oh. Oh, the lady. York, you goober. <laughs> oh, oh, I thought it was. I thought I was Naomi Watts. <laughs> no, York. I thought it was. Oh, I forgot. <laughs> I thought it was Naomi Watts. I might still be an FBI agent. But the case dealt such a blow to me, it shattered all those dreams. It didn't take Emily because I'm pretty sure that she's the fairy, right? That has to be it. I think so. Naomi Naomi Watts is the fairy. Yeah, so Naomi's still there. Okay, good. Well, his best friend's still with him then. It's fine. Who do you think benefited most from the Greenvale case? <sighs> no one benefited from it. Many lives were lost. That's all. You really believe that? Everyone who survived was overcome with sadness. Scarred for life. Without exception? Without exception. Isn't that right, my fairy? I feel like you're the one person who benefited from the case. You were able to add a new chapter to your stunning career and earned unshakable trust from the Chief. That's what allows you to go on using his intel network as you please even though you're retired. Are you seriously suggesting that? Sickness is destroying my body. I feel like I'm on the verge of losing my mind, yet somehow I'm unable to forget the cases connected to those seeds, whittling down what's left of my life, chasing them. You really think I'm doing all this for nothing but self-interest? Is that really what you're saying? He's going so hard, but he never told them anything. Like That's what he, that's the I think his plan. He could have said, "Hey guys, come into my room. I have a lot to tell you." But he we we did hours of shenanigans. So now we're in this situation. Melvin's cheerful exterior betrayed all the darkness that lurked within him. His happy-go-lucky personality was probably just his way of coping with reality. It all makes sense. Now I understand why he kept insulting Lena. Melvin wasn't the Fool King. What? Many different characters pop up in Lena's journal, and I mistook one of them for someone else. What are you talking about? After Simon hit me and I fainted, I had a dream. Now I'm convinced. I'm the Fool King. The Fool King was always meant to be an outsider who suddenly arrived in Lucare. And the man she felt a need to eliminate wasn't me, but Avery. Lena realized her plan was on the verge of falling apart. She also guessed that I would be able to save Patricia from Melvin. The one worry that remained in her heart was leaving Patricia behind and how her life would play out from that point on. Especially since she would be left behind with Avery, a large, childlike man who's beyond anyone's control. She wrote that journal entry hoping that I, the Fool King, would be capable of stopping Avery. And she wrote it in a specific way in order to try and rouse me to action. Lena and Melvin both entrusted me with their daughter. So please, just let me go. It's my duty to protect her. He signed a contract. <coughs> okay. Aaliyah's smart. She's top class, even within the FBI. She must understand that what I'm saying makes sense. The problem is that she's too smart the way she is now. She'll refuse to accept anything that can't be explained with logic. I understand what you're trying to say, but it's too perfect. 
It's too perfect, just like that report of yours. How could you come to such a detailed conclusion after spending years shut up in this room? It doesn't make sense. The only possible explanation is that you're bending the narrative in the direction you want it to go. Why do you think I left the field for two years after Greenvale? That case cost me not only my best friend, but also my special talent. I never thought I'd lose something like that. But ever since then, I've been unable to solve cases using that method. So he lost his deadly premonition? Offender profiling. Yeah, I guess so. I tried everything I could think of to regain my lost talent, but it never came back to me. That's why I quit working for the FBI. And without anywhere else to go, I simply spent my days seeking truth, searching for an answer I'd never find. <sighs> so time continued to cruelly pass me by. Until I thought oh. it was all over for me. <coughs> but about half a year ago, I finally reached my conclusion. Everything started with the red seeds. Duh! Jesse, is he growing red seeds inside of himself right now? Is that is, did he Did he figure and out that's that that's why he's you, possessed. And he's dying, and it's cancer or whatever, and he smokes weed to, like, make him not, but the red plant's growing in him right now. I, oh, shit. Uh, yeah, I believe it. I believe it. Maybe. He and I encountered these seeds long before we reached Greenvale. Under the seething, mind-melting sun of Louisiana. Then, for some reason, in the beginning of December, I finally regained my talent. And instantly, I could see the other world again. Get it? Hmm. Through allowing the cancer cells to ravage my body, I regained the power to travel to the other side. Or right, well, maybe not. This is the <laughs> only answer, Aaliyah Davis. Truth is a surprise born from coincidence and an unknown power. Her actions shocked me the most. How could a mother ever kill her own daughter? But I know the answer now. The Red Tree. The Red Tree can take control of everything. It's what leads us into the mouth of madness. She was the first perpetrator in the case. And technically, she was also the first victim. Maybe, well, it's impossible to ask her now, but maybe she really did love her daughter with all her heart. And so, she was afraid. Afraid of what would happen if her daughter did end up inheriting the Clarkson estate. It was fear, or something like it. That's what let the red tree inside. That's still no reason to kill someone. Especially not your own daughter. I know. Of course I know that. <sighs> and I'm sure that deep down, she did too. Hmm. It's probably going to be seeds. Melvin, yeah, I, I agree. Neither York nor I were able to uncover the darkness within you. How did we miss it? Are you and Candy finally happy now on the other side? Or are you still suffering, trapped by the bonds of the Red Tree? I made a promise with Melvin. He entrusted me with Patricia, all he had left. But immediately after you solved the case, you sent her to the Clarksons and left town. Isn't that right? You let go of her a long time ago. So you have no right to step back into the picture now. That was the wrong thing to do. I was young, but now I have the chance to right my wrong. How 
old do you think he was? <clears throat> in that uh, game, how old do you think he was? Uh, like in that game, by which I mean this game, two thousand five. Like in his twenties? Like I don't, I don't know. I, to be honest, I always yeah, he just looked like he was like Batman, right between like thirty and forty ish. He didn't seem old at all. He's in his forties. This is him in his forty. God, this uh, is so not the next ten years are not going to look good for me, Santel. <laughs> <laughs> don't don't even remind me, bro. I I yeah. Uh, third, oh, Velo oh, oh, oh. third Velociraptor wrote. So is the cancer in his body the blessing in disguise, Jesse? Like he couldn't, he he lost his power, but then the cancer came back and he got his powers back. So maybe that's the blessing in disguise. Let me tell you, if the blessing in disguise is the fact that he has cancer. I'm surprised that's not what people are upset about on the internet. <laughs> like, out of all the things to be upset about, the one sure. thing that they're like, yeah. don't you get it? His cancer's a blessing. Like, uh, I don't, uh, I don't know. Okay. Listen, I don't know what the blessing in disguise is. Something is a blessing, but I don't know what it is yet. Yeah. All right. You can't be serious. You can barely stand up. Hey, Aaliyah. I know, Agent Jones. I know I'm stepping over the line here. I just want to make it clear that we can't trust a word of what he says. Also, Simon's definitely in his 40s, too, right? Like, just, I'm just, the man's in his 40s. I don't. Si Simon <laughs> looks like he's 57. There's no, and Simon <laughs> looks awful. Yeah, Simon literally is a famed character actor. But but Aaliyah looks like she I th I picture her like starling like she's right out of the academy she's, she is one hundred percent she uh, right, she was a kid during Katrina uh, okay so she's like twenty six I mean she was a kid Katrina two thousand five and then it's two thousand nineteen so fourteen years later let's say. She's maybe, yeah, 27, 26. Yeah, yeah, sure. She went to college and then she went to the FBI. Okay. Yeah. Two bizarre cases derailed your life. It must have been extremely painful. You have my deepest condolences, but that doesn't put you in the clear. You're still a suspect. A suspect? Patricia isn't Whoa. here. For what? The murders of Sheriff Melvin Woods and Candy Woods. Their bodies were never recovered. Katrina carried them away, along with many other lives. Aside from that report you wrote, there's nothing that proves your innocence. Hey, let's not jump to conclusions here. Oh, I'm not. I also suspect there's a possibility that he murdered individuals connected to other cases that he's worked on. The Greenvale report bears the same inconsistencies as this one. And both cases are filled with victims whose deaths were never witnessed. Stop. Don't say another word. If you so much as mention her name. Don't do it. If I Don't mention, say it. Then what? Don't do it. The fairy's going to kick it. your ass. Say it. Naomi you Watts. will pay. Don't talk shit on Naomi Watts. Say her name. <gasps> Twinkle! We found it. We finally get to look at the fairy. Let's address the fairy Twinkle, in the room. My fairy. Oh. Don't look at me that way. Twinkle. I know how talented she is. I completely agree with you on that one. But I can't hand everything off to her just yet. Now that I understand. Like, I get the whole point of this is that he's actually testing her. And if there is a final chapter, it's going to be we play as Aaliyah. I bet that's happening. And guess what, Jesse? When York passes from this world, the fairy is literally going to go to Aaliyah. Or she becomes Aaliyah York, whatever her last name is. <laughs> oh, a little, a little, oh, see, I keep thinking that too, that York is going to go inside of her and she'll talk with him. I'm telling you, there's going to be something weird. I don't know what. Can you just let me get my way one last time? Dong, dong. Bell, no. Special Agent, Aaliyah Davis. Aaliyah York Davis. You're exceptionally talented, I admit it. You found Lisa's body. 
then discovered the red seeds all on your own. You even noticed that there was someone else in this room. You've got amazing intuition. You're a hunter with an extremely keen sense of smell, but you still can't perceive the other world the way you are now. That's all there is to it. Uh oh, we have a save file. Are we the fairy? Yay, we got it saved, Jesse. Do you think? Do you think the fairy's gonna undo Look the cuffs? inside that trash can? Yo, huh? the trash can? It's right behind you. Huh? Then you'll know for sure that I'm telling the truth. But what does this banana have to do with the case? <laughs> Flash forward? Flash back. To a few minutes ago? <laughs> to literally a few yeah, minutes ago? Not to touch the sanctuary! But what is the sanctuary? It doesn't this, make This is their been this is their bathroom conversation. What is this? I'm the one who sent Aaliyah the tip and set everything in motion. We need to talk alone. Uh, well, yeah. No, I get it. We all figured that out. FK! Oh, no. FK is inside him. FK's inside of his body. That's why. What? FK Fool King? Oh, my God. What's on that receipt? What is <laughs> it? What is it, Agent Jones? F. K. Oh, holy crap. Huh. Flashback. Contact a local <laughs> agent and have them investigate Avery Smith's home. There are still agents investigating the Lucare area, right? Trust me. That's where Patricia Clarkson is. Trust you? Where's your proof? Ask Aaliyah Davis. Ask her about the name of the person who tipped her off. What do you mean? You're from Chicago. <laughs> and you love pizza, right? Oh my god. Especially deep dish pizza, smothered in cheese. What does this have to do with <laughs> pizza? Just ask her. And. Ask her why she decided to take this case in the first place. Got it? Pizza will never betray you. So you need to trust it, too. Pizza will never but betray you. How could you have known that I would come here with her? I didn't. I just bet on you. God damn it. Hey! Tell me what's going on right now, Agent Jones. Look, the, the fairy, fairy got fairy. out! Oh, the no! Real. Thank you, my fairy. Jesse, the fairy is real. Car key, Simon. Let me go. Don't worry. <clears throat> Just trust in the pizza. I'm the anonymous tipper. F.K. Eh, it's on the corner of 3rd Street. 69 Pontiac GTO. You've got excellent taste. Lend me your gun, too. Agent Jones! Don't you see what you're doing here? This is a severe obstruction of justice. You're violating the FBI code. <laughs> yeah, Aaliyah, I know, but pizza will never betray me. He <laughs> 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 to prepare a private jet for me at the airport. I know Robert won't turn his back on me. Wait, Morgan, are you serious? The chief would never lend out a private jet to a civilian like... Like, um... Dude, is seeing the ferry now? I think he's seeing the ferry. What?! I have to leave you for a bit, my ferry. They'll be fine. They'll figure it all out. Don't worry, Naomi Watts. Put on your outfit. Put on your good outfit. Yeah, put on the good outfit. Daddy's coming home. Yo, You're, we're gonna be an old man, Jesse, and our stamina bar is gonna be going one to go third of what it was. The job you started. That makes us even, okay? Hmm. York, she really is a genius agent. 
She's probably going to end up being an even better agent than we were. She just needs more experience under her belt. Jesse, is this setting up Deadly Premonition 3? She can see with her naked no eye. way! She needs to experience more frustration. She needs to strengthen herself. <laughs> On the other hand, Simon's much smarter than he looks. No wonder he was able to go on watching us for four and a half years. All go towards the light, Marianne! In the end. <laughs> Do you want to know why he decided to start trusting me? It's simple. It's all because of the name I used to send the tip to the FBI. It's the name of that pizza parlor. The Chicago-style place with those trademarked crimson boxes. What? Franklin's Kitchen. FK! FK. Yet again. What? They've got the best deep dish pizza in the area. Both Simon and I love that place. That's why I told him, pizza will never betray you. Will it, York? Is Franklin's <laughs> Kitchen a real place? No, but the fact that it has red boxes and shit? Actually, is it a real place? Can Krendergaard try Franklin's Kitchen for us? <laughs> So the game's not over, right? <laughs> I don't know what's happening right now. I don't know what's happening right now. Five, Five hours later. Five hours later. <laughs> oh. Oh. I knew this place was going to be a demon portal. We, I was so confused when we didn't hit it in the York. very first mission. Yeah, here it is. It's almost time. Let's finish this. I'll be there soon. Watch my back, will you? This is going to be my final battle. So I'm this far gone, huh? But unlike 14 years ago, I feel more at home in this world now. Uh, do I have the power to finger bang Santel? Yes, absolutely. Of course you do. He's always the finger banging comes with the deadly Yeah, the finger banging comes from within. Yeah, the finger banging was always with us. Oh wow, there's tons of stuff here. Okay. If this is the final battle, then plenty of ammo, bandages, oh, we need more coffee. You're not you're not gonna get hungry. I'm not worried about food. Yeah, food's not an issue. We can probably remove it if we have it. Yeah, we got some oh no. Hey! Good job! Hey! Remember to save always. Remember to save. Yo, your time is about to go up like yeah, days, hours. <laughs> Three hundred and forty three hours. Well I don't know what's wrong. We kill it in this game. Nothing. There's nothing. Eh, I guess not. Do, 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 do. I can't wait to see the enemies. Snarf. Yeah, the 2019 snarfs. Maybe they're different. 2019 snarfs and sexy crawly girls and doormen. Doormen. John. John. Doormen. <laughs> Snarf. <laughs> and then the girls oh. would go four. <laughs> Ooh, here we go. We're just Except back in the house. This, this is so silly. Why are we in the house now? No questions. Don't. Ooh. <laughs> Four. <laughs> they remind me of the ladies in the first game that crawl on the ceiling. Yeah, the ladies who walk backwards in the first game are my favorite ladies. Four. Look at you getting that money bonuses still. I'm gonna reload. I'm gonna take my time. Four. I'm so glad we got this music. Yeah, this the, the King Kong music. Yeah, the Summon Kong music. The worst part is, is because because of the layouts, I know exactly uh. where. Like how all this is going down, and I hate it. 
Although I'm glad I, can, I get to see these ladies when they're not like, you know. Covered in red. Yeah, when they're not all red. And oh, shit. Where'd that, that guy popped up? A door boy. <laughs> Yay! Yay! Yeah, so just gotta power up like Mega Man. Oh no! Do you want to go through the other doors? Um, there are so many doors to go through right now. I'm just gonna explore all the halls first. Okay. Listen, I think either Francis or Ooh, Zach. Ooh, that lady. She she got like skin tight outfit on and stuff. Yo, they should add Francis York Morgan to Smash. And he's sort of like the old sheik. He can, like, go between York and uh, Zack mode. All right. We're back on this bullshit, huh? This is, a good, this is a good idea. This is a good idea. Look at this nonsense. Come on. Turn around, buddy. Where's the real you to shoot? What is the... What is the you that I need to shoot? Golly. These explosive bullets are so good on the Krabby Boys. Is he still alive? Are you kidding me? Turn around. What? This this enemy is so dumb. Good boss fight. I love the lock guys. They're super cute. All right, well, we have several ways to go. No map. What I am gonna do is, uh oh. Copy. Well, this seems like a proper way to go. Yep. Hello. Ooh. I'm just waiting for these bastards to spawn right on me. Your old man fisticuffs are so strong. What can I say? Yeah, yeah, yeah. What can I say? I'm a strong kind of guy. There's no one in this room, huh? All right, I'm okay with that. Just a lot a of supply, tables. Last, just a supply room. Uh, that's the one way. Uh huh. This way. Oh, my favorite boys! <laughs> Great shot. Well, that time it murdered him. Whoa. Another one. Another one bites my dust. What? Me? What? So weird. So weird. It's crazy I... that you shoot in the same spot twice and one does 30 and one does two. Yeah, there's like two different damage variables. That time I hit him in the knee and he's like, ow! <laughs> Too much. Snarf! It's so weird that they would use the, the spooky house again. Why wouldn't they? Because it's all mental, man. Okay. It's the Clarkson family estate. Yeah, it's it's their 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 hands on everything. Yeah. Big room, Snarfy boy. Well, that Perfect. worked. <laughs> that was great. Snarfy boy. What the? I hit everything but this guy. Let me reload, Snarfy boy. <laughs> Snarf! This bitch. Is pizza a blessing in disguise? 
I don't think there's any disguise <laughs> about it. Pizza is always a blessing. Pizza, as, as our prayer goes, pizza in the morning, pizza in the evening, pizza at supper time. Yeah. If pizza's on a bagel, you, you can, can eat pizza, pizza anytime. anytime. Yeah, yeah. This is bullshit. They got me, they got me trapped in Yo! here. How is this the thing? Don't get that. Don't get a game over, Jesse. We'll lose our S ranks. How is this a thing, you fucking Mardi Gras piece of shit? <laughs> yeah. You want to tie me up? Those Sorry. chains are actually those chains are actually beads. There we go. Jesus. Why does it sometimes work and sometimes not? It's just ludicrous. Ludicrous. Heal yourself. Okay. Okay. Band-aid. Whoa, they're the ceiling ladies. She came back. Yeah. Four. They were so hard in the first game. They are not that difficult in this game. Yeah, when you have a power up, when you can finger blast them. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah they ain't even true. that hard. Yeah, in the first game, we didn't have that. Dick. Dick. <laughs> Dick. Thanks for waiting. <laughs> Snarf. Take that, ICP. We're not dealing with you today. Yeah, no thanks. Papa Roach. <laughs> Cut my love in two pieces. <laughs> oh, music was so aggressive in 2000. All those it is my last resort. All those punk rock bands. Mm, Adore right. Boy. I bet there's Snarfies in here, too. Of course there are. Come on. What if I... Yeah. Good job. Did I blow him up with his own lock boys? Uh oh. No, he's just chilling around the corner. Two of them. Two assholes. Someone's knocking on the door. Come on. Oh, you're a dick. Are, is the door supposed to represent what's your name being tied to the bed? What? Like, all of these monsters, do they have something to do with the Clarkson? Yeah, every monster represents one of the Clarkson kids. So this was so the door is the girl who was tied up. Yo, she's got like a night she's got like a sexy nighty on. Yeah, I like I like her little sexy nighty. It's very nice. <laughs> There's so many of you, and you're so impossible to hurt. This is a bullshit. This is bullshit. Oh, there's three of them. Yeah. Come on, turn around, I'm buddy. I'm powering up my mega blaster. Da 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 da. How though? Da 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 da. It's in the doors. You face. So dumb. Door Eagle is so broke on these door guys. I can't. Come on, two. Thirty. So those were headshots. Whatever were a headshot they? means. Uh, no, no, were they, they were like, no, they were like neck shots. They're like trach holes. Oh. What the fuck? Come on. Come Where's on. the right spot? Oh, do you think it's different every time? No! No, I just think it's a buggy mess. 
I think this weapon is an explosive shot that for some reason doesn't work properly on these enemies. Oh no. But it works so good on everyone else. Yes, it works great on everyone else. It's just a waste of ammo on these guys. Do you want to punch them? Fuck him. <laughs> Careful, well, we have our solution, dear friend. <laughs> <laughs> Go full Spartan on him. Yeah, it's, I'm done. I'm done shooting him. Full punch mode. You're right. Yeah. Punch. I punched a guy and it did 20 times more damage. Yeah. Oh, lady! right thing all along. Oh, they're all like... Oh, she has a, a tentacle! Yeah, I saw that. Knock, knock, son of a gun. Knock, knock, you son of a bitch. Tie this up. Ooh. <laughs> I can't believe that's working! <laughs> <laughs> All right, before we move into this area. Yeah, 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 yeah. Here we go. I don't know what this could possibly be. It's going to be another dungeon. It's going to be another hallway. It's going to be gonna one of those areas like where we explore things. I get, like, it's going to be, oh, investigate the scene. I just don't know what the scene will be. The secret, the hidden laboratory? Sure, okay. Oh my god. Oh no, it's meat room! Our favorite room. With the full on buffalo heads. Oh yeah, the buffalo assets. Hey, buddy. Not about the buffalo heads. Do you think this is gonna be one of those things where, like, they spawn everywhere? Yes. I, I do, I do feel like we're gonna fight a bunch of them in a very small area. Oh, interesting. What? That's the way we came. Is that a save point? Yes. Okay. Weird that this is here. Yeah, I think it's here because it was here. It's here in the normal world. Right, 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 right. It's weird that this is like a uh, location they included. Yeah. Or, or maybe, uh, or maybe this is literally just a save point for item. Like, if you're bad at the game, get some items, and now you're gonna go into another scary house. I gotta rise it got up. It. You got Down this, Rocky. <laughs> you got this, kid. That's show him who's boss. Cut him. Cut him. All right, we're ready. We're ready for this this boss fight. No, this is the way we came. No, this isn't. I thought this was. No, we entered through the other side of the building. Oh, okay. I'm okay. 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 For sure, we did. Do 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 do. Oh boy! Oh boy! Oh boy! Oh boy! Oh boy. Oh boy. You're right, this is new. Yeah. Um. Problem is my normal shells don't have any buffs. Let's keep using, let's keep using the explosive ones. Yeah. I like my explosive boys, they're nice. If I need to for a boss, oh, this bitch. Good eyes. Four. Yeah, we did like 120 damage. Hi, room service. Hello, boys. That did only 20? Ah, sharpshooter bonus. Hey, where are you going? Come back. Oh, 
I don't understand. I don't understand 90% of what this game does. All you gotta do is hit him in the arm perfectly. Yeah, all Just you gotta do like that. His arm was his weakness. You would think that old man uh, Zach would put on clothes, like a, like his old outfit. Here's the thing. Do you think she's single? That lady? Oh, absolutely. It's COVID time, baby. Everyone's single. <laughs> What does that yes. say about me? Yes, she has Zoom dates, but like she's not seeing anybody. Yeah. Nothing serious. Jesse, you want to date the girl two blocks down from you that you didn't know that you're both living in the same building. So you just haven't found her yet. <laughs> Do you think this is supposed to represent who is this girl supposed to represent? Uh Galena? Either the or their yeah, daughter, or, or uh, uh, Lise. It might be Lise. Maybe Candy, because Candy was all bound up, but the, all the everyone was bound up. There's a lot of ba binding in this game. Yeah. Ain't that the truth? Cut it out! Ha ha! I forgot this bullshit. Uh oh. I'm trying to avoid using the uh cuz you know you know someone's about to spawn on my ass like yeah! yep like that bullshit just like that bullshit What the fuck One and done great Okay Snarf that shit All right here we go Knock knock are you kidding me? Knock, knock, bitch. <laughs> <laughs> Best strategy ever. Best strategy oh. ever. He's tied to a board. What do we do? Just punch him. <laughs> yeah, just punch his ass. He can't do anything. His weapon are a bunch of lock crabs. Lock crab. Uh, what was it? Lock lobster. Lock lobster. <laughs> when you've got a lobster and it's made of a lock. Lock a lobster. Lock a lobster. Was <laughs> <laughs> uh, uh. there anything else here? No. This was the main way to go. If it unlocked, then yes. Those doors usually, I think those power doors usually, yeah, because there's the lock, there's the... Hello, boy. Uh-oh. Let me reload my hand. <laughs> it's so funny. Watch out, they... Lino that they gave them a diving, like a jump dive attack, and in most of the areas, they can't jump. <laughs> yes. What's even funnier is that if you get hit by it, you get like a, like, it does major stun damage to you. Shut up, lady. Where's your sweet spot? Where's your sweet spot? Oh, fuck it. Oh, 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 check there. Get out of here. The crowd. <laughs> the, gra the grabs. <laughs> no, wait. <laughs> Never mind. Damn it. I'm so dumb. <laughs> I have so much ammo. Yeah. Anything else in this room? Boxies? No, just a dressed a dresser and a bureau. Yeah, it's just, it's just an enchanted castle in here. What the? Oh, this she, bitch! She I wasn't even looking. I wasn't even looking. She got me. 
She got the jump on you. Unlike my real life, this woman threw herself at me. <laughs> oh, uh, <laughs> I'm, I'm fine, I think. I'm not gonna stress about my life too much. My, I meant like game life, not real life. Oh, 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 oh this bitch! Oh, it's so funny. I can't tell if Jesse's cries or laughter or crying. Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> send in the clouds. <laughs> Vor. Full fingers. Another box of bullets. I have I, more bullets than a man could use. I guess you should heal. Sure, I just want to shoot that lady off of the <laughs> building. <laughs> Good job, great snipe. You know, I just had a finger blast that lady for a hot sec. Don't worry. Did, did real good. Got her right off the uh, roof. Yeah, she, you know, she was crawling off the walls, and I just had to go in there and finger blast. You know how it is. I'm crawling off the walls again. Whoa. I hate, I hate you for that. You don't like Sugar Cult? Sugar Cult wasn't a band for you. <laughs> oh, whoa. Yeah, that's that's their jam. Four. Well, the question is, was that this way? Oh, this asshole. I actually don't know. Dodged you, bitch. What? What? Ooh. That guy was like, hold on, let me try that again. What the fuck? God damn it. Jeez, and you're, and you're paralyzed. Oh, that's ass, 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 ass. You should have paralyzed medication. I do. That's so dumb. Oh, uh, what ass that was. Bling. So stupid. What was this way? I think you were... No. I can't tell if that was the right door or if there's a door down here. I don't know. Vor door. Uh-oh. Well, that's clearly a thing, and so is this. Oh, no. That's... This is the way. This is the way. This is the way. Huh. So many rubber bullets. Okay. Who's Great. spawning on me? I always feel like Somebody spawns on me. Oh, shit. Oh. Slap that butt. <laughs> More. All right. So we only got one way to go. I'm not saying Swery's budget went into crafting that butt, but, like, that was a nice butt. They spent time on it. They had yeah. They spent. About it someone sure. was like, "All right, we have, we have, three basic enemies. One of them is gonna be handcrafted ass." Yo, I wonder if everybody knows about these sweet doorway tactics. Wow, I can't believe I just got two for one. I'm rolling around 500 bucks cash in my pocket. <laughs> Got you, Start baby. That shit, bitch. <laughs> now where them door boys at? <laughs> oh, With here comes them ass ladies. No, but for real. What is going on? What is going on? What she's is going gonna, on? Swearing. She's gonna, she's gonna, I don't know. Butt crack is designed. It's like I'm looking at an Overwatch character. <laughs> <laughs> got more ass than an Overwatch character. I feel like that is definitely a line. Like, damn, girl, you got more ass than an Overwatch character. Don't try it, Jesse. <laughs> Please don't try it. <laughs> don't, don't try it, okay? Keep it, keep what? It, keep no? it in the stream. I don't, I don't know if it works on the ladies. I don't know. It's a very specific lady that that works on. Yeah, a lady that I'd like to date. 
<laughs> I just got an update. As I said that on my screen, an update popped up and says Mech Warrior 5 update. I think that's pretty funny. <laughs> Don't know why. I was just about to say that your in-game clock is wrong, but I forgot the in-game time is not real-world time. It no, just the sort in-game of... time is something else. I don't know yeah. what it is. It's, it's pretty something. close. It's pretty close to what we're doing. <laughs> this lady. This lady. Hey, baby girl. <laughs> Ooh. Light those buns of steel on fire. Sometimes, sometimes they just can't finish the sentence. And I gotta finish it for them. Four! Not, I'll take not, $22. Not. Why does the government keep paying me? Well, you're working under the books. The professor or whatever, the head of the FBI is fine with you. Comey has no problem with your illegal actions. Comey wasn't in charge in 2019. Oh, was he outed by then? Yeah. And listen, whoever we got draw with at the bureau, they love us. Yikes! Bureau Director Abraham, I believe oh, is yeah, the name Abraham. they use. Oh, F this. There we go. <laughs> <laughs> it's so funny that his dick kick him. And he goes down. He's like, oh, come on. What year is Control taking place? Could Francis York Morgan show up in that game? Here's the thing. Control takes place now. So technically, yes. But he'd be an old man. He'd be like this. He'd be this. Yes. Mm. I have no idea what's about to happen here. I'm so. I still have no clue. I have no clue where this is going. I know. Well, we're gonna find out. The There's Avery gonna be a final mystery. twist, and it's gonna be yeah. weird, and I can't wait. But I just don't know where it's going. Yeah, we still have to find another demon baby. If Patty is like, I have a tree in me, I'm gonna be like, what? I think that's where this is going. You think we're going full on tree? I think this all leads to tree. Do you think this area has um very I have so many bullets. I have so a many bullets. Do you think this area is similar to the first time we're here and that there were secrets? Yes. Jesse, you genius. I bet there's some beads in here. What the hell? You saw that, right? Yes. Okay. This music's so crazy. It is that. This, this is murder music. This is the music of someone trying to go save a little girl, but like that little girl is now in in her late twenties. But is distracted by this. Actually, we might have just seen the carts. I mean, maybe, but there's also shit in here. There was. Yeah. There weren't that many carts. Maybe there were. Boop, 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 that was an inside a man's eyes. Pull? I think it's this way. Okay. Really? Is there nothing in here? We did this. This is what we did on we day one. We definitely did this, but we're in like a special world. And I figured maybe, just maybe. Mm, maybe. Oh, maybe. That looks like a maybe. Yeah, I'm trying to... That's the crouch. Son of a bitch. Okay, and... Yeah. And. Uh, uh, okay. 
Nailed it. You did it. You got Yo. to the break, the break room. <laughs> Worth it. Pro. I need to see what's gamer. in there. What's in the other world's version of this? It's finally those red beans we were looking for. You know what? Coke. Let's, let's get some $4 coffee. Hell yeah. Nice. It literally was all the things you could move. Silly. There you go. But we did it. Ha <laughs> ha. Look at us. Is there no place to save? No, there is not. Why? Okay. I don't like this old man version. Why isn't he picking up beads? Where is his old plates? This doesn't feel like our, our original self. Okay, let's go into that portal. That song's too chill. We we in it right now. The music's like. No, nope. nope, that's what the end of this game's gonna be. Oh, I do think we're gonna get some classic jams. Look at this I don't know. Nonsense. Yeah, ladies everywhere. Just it's ladies night. <laughs> That's right, ladies in the underworld drink free on Thursday. All right, I shouldn't waste my time. I should just blast them. How are there so many? You had a dual kill bonus. I guess you killed her uh, tentacle thing too. Damn right I did. Any more ladies? Hot dog. I'm just afraid like eight more guys are going to spawn right in that spot now. Yeah. Well, <laughs> the explosion solved that problem. Nailing it, nailing it, nailing it. I think this is the right way to go, so maybe you want to go down the other hallway? I simply don't know. Okay. Whoa, no, this, is, this is a trap. It's a box room. This is a trap. This is a box trap. Also, thanks. <laughs> Yay! Thanks for the prep. This is a little worrisome. It's so silly that the game gives you money and makes us do things. Like, we didn't need any. Like we didn't, The money okay, barely great. did anything in this game, by right. the way. What was the point of it? We just collected money. You know, so he could get rich and have that nice apartment in Boston. That's right. Well, he had to, he had to do it like, you know, save for your retirement during your working years. Yeah. By murdering a scissor men. And, and horny ladies. That's how my grandpa did it. <laughs> That's and how his grandfather that. before him. Uh, killing ladies and scissor men. That's what we do here <laughs> in America. Putting down scissor men and sexy ladies every day. Uh, sometimes we get a dull man or two, but they're no problem for us. We're deadly premonitioners. I'd have a premonition, a deadly one. See? I'd punch dull men every day. <laughs> every time I entered a new apartment complex, punch that dull man right in the face. Yeah. Like, hey there, Charles. Punch. Oh, a door Why boy. do I even Hello. bother? Hello, door man. Damn it. All I do is set myself up to get blown up by these guys the minute I... I know, I know. Like, look, I don't have control yet. There we go. Yeah, look at that. Blue, I don't blue. have any control. <laughs> it doesn't even let me have control, Santel. Just a <laughs> giant waste of everyone's time. That's okay. We'll use one of our 50 million first aid kits. Okay. Hello. 
I'm a little worried. My keyboard just went out. I lost keyboard power. That's oh no! Bizarre. The All rainbow. Right. The rainbow show stopped. Vor, my dude, cut it out. Chill. I can shoot him through the door. <laughs> Great. Bug, bug yourself, fool. Thanks, bro. All right, let's end this. Hey. Knock, knock. Oh. Oh. Knock, knock. Let me in. <laughs> let us in. Not by the hair of my chinny chin chin. Right in his old dick. Right in his big dumb dick. Take that, lock boy. Go back and work in the harbor. <laughs> Save the money for New Game Plus? Yeah, no, we'll totally do that. Oh, there's for sure going to be a New Game Plus. Yeah, for sure we will play New Game Plus. Why wouldn't we? I can't... Oh, this isn't the right way. We want to go to the door, yes? This. Yeah, the, the the door with yeah. Hi yo mi yo yo yo. Ay dios mijo. Lady, I am right now. You're doing so good. Where is she? Oh, that's her tentacle. My palace? By the way, that's 100% Patricia's voice, right? I believe so. That's the vo same voice actress. That ass, though. Come on, this is awful. come on. Why did you make Don't this, this for me, this buddy? Way? Don't ruin okay, this for okay, me. Okay, okay, okay. Also, we are cold. <laughs> we got we got a case of the chills now. Oh, they got us sick. We got to take some flu medicine. They gave us they gave us the chills. Cold be gone. Damn. Four ladies. Four. Coffee, bullets, ready to go. <laughs> like every good detective, all I need is coffee and bullets. Okay, here's the door. Any ladies? Any snarfers? Hey, ladies. Get, Where are my snuffers at? Get, get funky. Yeah. Knock, knock, hey, knock. ladies. Where are my snuffers at? Hey, ladies. Where are my snuffers at? Oh! Got jumped. You bitch. Snick that. You're good. You didn't get paralyzed. He didn't snick you too hard. Is there a lady? I don't see a lady. Oh, okay. Trust me, my eyes are open. <laughs> yeah, you you would definitely know if there was a lady here. Yeah, if there was a lady present, I would be aware. Trust me. Ladies, 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 ladies. Nope, ladies, room is clear. Ladies. On to the next one. A lady. Oh, my. I'd love to have their noises explained. Why do they make, why did they say VoIP and snarf? I don't, I don't know. I don't think we are meant to know. I don't think we as humans are meant to know. Well, this uh -oh. is dangerous. <laughs> All right. <laughs> Well, Hot dog, right what it done. <laughs> they all walked into that shit. You racking up the monies. 
We end monies. We end monies. I hope the final boss is just like all the other bosses where I just run around and shoot a baby. Yeah, I think I absolutely think it's going to be that. Or maybe you get a special Avery boss where he we see his demonic side or whatever. Oh, come on. No time for this. Eat my fist of fury. <laughs> not, not, bitch. Thank God we trained uh, with that meat, with the eye of the tiger. Yeah, at the beginning, you know what? Totally worth it. Totally worth it. Snarf. Lion. Oh, Lion -o. Oh, I don't Lion -o. think we should fight these bad guys. We shouldn't fight these bad guys, Lion-O. Okay. Hey, we made it to a save. It's our gator. Oh, that one gator's ripped in half, though. Well, it could be better than golf with the gator. Golfing with the gator. I don't think we're going to... You know what? I'm going to keep him just in case. Okay. Still don't know what song screen does. Still, Still don't know. Tell you. Don't know what that mechanic is all about. Fights off the strongest UV rays? What does that mean? Mint gum we don't need. That's for my BO. Yeah, yeah, uh, we're fine. We smell fine. Yeah, I don't need I don't need that. My BO's okay. Mm. Cold be gone just in case. Yep. And um you know what, Santel? You know what I'm gonna do? Manual save. No, what are you gonna do? The sun lo the sun tan lotion? Yeah, Hell do? yeah. What's it do? I don't even know. I don't even know why I used it. But here we are. What if the suntan lotion improves our gun? Our handgun? It's probably going to do a lot of things. That we never thought of. You should be wearing suntan lotion. Skin damage is a real big problem. It's I true. learned that on Skin Decision. I hate you for knowing that name. <laughs> Okay, we've been here. Yeah. Yeah. There's literally roots on the ground there. Where are the secret passageways? I can feel it, York. There's something Ooh. in this room. What do you say we gather up some puzzle pieces for old time's sake? So was his... he? So is York back inside of him now? He keeps saying so. Oh, my God. Is Oh, my... Is All right, he, Jesse. Is he a Wendigo? What is... <laughs> What happened to him? Profile Look time, him. baby. Look at him. I know. Man got back mumps. Want to use them eyeballs? Of course I do. Really? Nothing behind us? And neither of them is, none of those is the next unlock. Hmm. All right. Interesting. Artificial heart lung machine. And Was he keeping her alive? Some sort of liquid. If it isn't frozen at this temperature, it must be a non-freezing liquid. That's what the red juice they, they were pumping into that lady. Yeah, into candy. It couldn't be cryonics. Did he replace Lisa's bodily fluids with this stuff? That's absolutely insane. <laughs> <laughs> Jesse, are you crying or laughing? I can't tell. Is everything okay? Oh, shut up. <laughs> <laughs> Why does he look like this now? Please. He's got Bye, tumors. Please. Maybe. Why? <laughs> okay, okay. Well, her mom killed her because they were all Please. part of a weird ass cult. Please. Please. Hey, dude, at least you get to see her one last time. Hey, oh! <laughs> Come on, dude, you got bumps all over you. That's the least of your worries. You're broken, bro. This is a problem. 
So it really was you, Avery. I finally found the ten-foot-tall giant. How, though? Lena once said that the red soul could enhance people's unique characteristics. It made In him taller. Case, it must have enhanced your physical characteristics. What? Personally, though, I don't think enhance is the right word here. Like Popeye. This is simply a physical mutation caused by a drug overdose. <laughs> Lisa. This juicy. It came from that powder. Yup. Gave me strength. I'll, I'll put it in Lisa's body. Yup. So Lisa, stay pretty. Forever. <laughs> do you think final boss is this mutant Avery, or do you think we fight the final woman in the ice? Final boss is juice up lease. Okay, <laughs> for sure. <laughs> he kind of laughs like me. Uh, yes, he does. He laughs a lot like you. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Okay, okay, okay. Settle down, buddy. <laughs> I'll make lease pretty. Yep. <laughs> I'll, I'll spread her out all knee and, and protect her. Lise Clarkson, the first victim of the Lucari case. Maybe she did become a goddess. Maybe the whole point is that he's like, don't you see? I'm going to put Lise in Patricia's body. I don't know. Mm. I never thought she'd remain trapped in ice for 14 whole years. Hey, York. Why didn't we work harder to find her? Well, because we were busy chasing dogs and uh, we had to bowl a bunch. I had a skateboard. I was hungry for Bananas Foster. Yeah, and all that stone skipping. I regret it from the bottom of my heart now. Yeah, someone had to kill those squirrels. What do you think these squirrels are gonna kill themselves? Yeah. So pretty. I'll protect you forever. Yep. Swery's getting mileage off the text font from uh uh JJ Macfield. Yeah. Least smiled. She's Smiling at me. Yup. <laughs> Lisa's smiling. She's smiling. No one ever. When comes. you're smiling. <laughs> when you're smiling. I can hide Lisa. The whole world. This will be Jesse after a couple more months of quarantine. Y'all have no clue. Oh my god. Yesterday. Uh, some guy sent me a video and he's like, hey, check out this girl reviewing the, like a bar setup. And it was like some Avery Irish girl like talking about booze. And I was like, I think I'm in love with you. <laughs> you I know I don't know who this person fucking is. I was just yeah. like, oh, my God, a woman. <laughs> I think I love you. Should we get married now? Yeah. Oh, I'm uh, you have to put me on ice. I'm already too thirsty. <laughs> it's like, holy shit. He made his own personal altar that no one would ever find. And that liquid must be the solution that San Rouge is made from. He used that to keep her body from decomposing. There's the seeds. Oh. Red seeds. Here's the Didn't problem. We... We're at the end of the facility. There's nowhere else to go. Yeah. I knew it, York. The secret lab. 
I guess you're right. Began the moment we first visited this town. God damn it. Ah, oh, damn. Of seeds. Hmm. It was behind that door this whole time, Jesse. You think there's a mission 69? Oh, yes. Can it might be there? the final. The oh, final we might be the final mission. mission. Absolutely. Yeah, that makes sense to me, too. Also, what? Oh. Go collect some items. A giant bathtub? No. This is a container for unloading crawfish. Of course. He must have used this to freeze Lisa's body in ice. Why didn't I figure this out sooner? Because you were you had a little girl walking around with you and you were busy trying to impress her then do your job, you weirdo. He did drop the ball. Like the fact that we thought it was Avery from day one. Like, like the okay. minute we got there, we were like, it's definitely yeah, Avery, it's, but that can't be right. Another full weird circle. This is beyond freezer burn. The meat's all shriveled up. Forgotten gator bones. All the way down here, Katrina still found a way to make her mark. Hmm. Okay. One of the key ingredients to Cajun cuisine. Utterly wasted. <laughs> so basically, this area has not been. No one's used this since we investigated it. With me when I first came here. Yeah, since we were here, none of this has been touched. Were these frozen oysters? Hard to tell now. After the hurricane, no one entered this warehouse for a long time. And, okay. Yeah, it looks moldy. Yeah. That's sad that some would freeze oysters. <laughs> what are these huge crab legs doing here? Or are they shrimp legs? Not that it matters. What? We need to find kind of shrimp? No one eats shrimp legs. Don't eat shrimp legs. That's yeah, not a that's, good... That's someone that's... ripping you off. The yeah, don't, don't eat those. Somehow, this lone box is completely undamaged. Is there... Divine power at play here? Somehow I doubt it. I've had I enough of those fairy tales. Disagree. Divine power was completely at play. Uh. Okay. And what's Red this? Lead this way. This is where the final secret is hidden. Yeah. Oh boy. I know York. One more dungeon. Aaliyah and Simon would never be able to reach the other world through their mundane investigation. That's why we need to close this case. All right. For real, though, if we have to go through another dungeon, just look in the next room. There's so much shit in there. It's unnecessary. York? I know. Zach, whoever you are, look at it. Yeah. Literally. Yeah. Strong grip. There's dolls and shit in there. Strong enough yeah, to crush It's going to be creepy. Door. This must be the entrance to the Smarty Pants Scientist's lab. I'm just saying, look at this area. I know. Look at this! Oh, Jesus. Here we go. Actually, hold on. What am I doing? I going to this, could be a gonna smart go save it? man. Oh, yes. You're so smart. Oh, oh. And my coffee just showed up. I'm so excited. Let's go. Ooh, is the missus there? Hello? She's gone now. She just, oh. She's in the kitchen. She went to the grocery store. She didn't want to hear me regale her with the tale of... How I shot a woman in the ass, and it was awesome. no. For some reason, for some reason, she's not into that. For some reason, but I'll get Weird. her on the microphone. All right, I'll get her on well, the mic. I, figured, I, I figured I would tell her, but all right, you know your wife she better probably, than I do. She probably wants to hear about you shooting that lady's ass. I don't know. We gotta ask her. <laughs> I guess you're right. I just figured I'd bring up a casual conversation. Like, remember when I shot that lady's ass? And then you'd be like, I can't. You know, you'd be like, yeah, yeah, it was so cool. And then you like kind of hype me up to her, and then she'd be, tell all of her friends like, yeah. Michael knows a guy who shoots ass. And they'd be like, ooh, tell me more. You want me to set you up with one of my wife's friends? Not okay. at all. Never. No. I get you. I don't know who it's going to be. Not at all. Okay. No, I definitely don't want that. <laughs> He's into ass shooting is what I heard. Yeah, actually, can you, actually, if you did that, if you specifically said he shoots ass. Yeah. I want to see what kind of friend she sets me up with. <laughs> she, she she would say he shoots ass, and then the friend would go ass to ass question mark. And yeah, and like, then That's I the would one. go That's ass to ass. You love that ass to ass. Like yeah. ass to ass. Yeah, for sure. Yeah, get out of here, door. We need an old man on a get mission. Out of here, door man.
I just want I just want to see you know who based on that description alone I've always I've never had an online profile for like a dating website but what if I like based on just <laughs> quotes of shit I say on streams as a goof we just used only that and it was like huge fan of shooting ass just like real crazy I wonder who would match me with You would you would you would match with you'd match with people that either have a, this a very similar sense of humor or you're going into a sex dungeon. It's I mean, one of the here's two. Here's the thing: you gotta live sometimes. You do gotta live sometimes. You gotta live so sometimes. You gotta live. What the hell? Yeah, sometimes you gotta live. Live to win, as I always say. Serial killers. That's probably true. I probably wouldn't last long. Okay, well, this room is the way. This is the way, Santel. This is Did the it way. Did it spawn behind me? Mm, it must have. Game, why do you think we need so many boxes? We just. We it is preparing. I think this game is like, hey, maybe gamers need help. I'm fine with that. I'm fine with being overprepared for a boss. Well, I do think that the the game doesn't incentivize you to do side missions and stuff. So, like, I could very easily see someone... If you didn't do anything and just lost your money to the, you know, rent and stuff like that, you would might you might be out of bullets by that point. So, okay, that's nice. True, but also you probably wouldn't learn the awesome power that is punching door demons. <laughs> that's true. You know, there's probably at some point someone was like, uh, sorry, sir, should we uh, fix this door demon bug? He's like, no, let them punch. Hi, punch. Let them punch. I got to get to this guy before he spawns little boys. Uh, 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 get him. Get those little boys. Punch those little boys. Good job. Got him. <laughs> it's not, it's never not it. fun. It's great. It's, it's so silly. Fun. I have so many. I have a ludicrous sum of bullets right now. If I get to a final boss and it's like, you ran out of bullets, I will be shocked. Spawn room, baby. We good? You amazing. Just, just, just great. Ooh, lo lock boys. Yeah, more I knew guys, that shit was yeah, going to yeah, happen. Yeah, more guys are going to come. Here's the lady. Blast that ass. Blast that ass. Knock, oh, knock, right bitch! <laughs> right out of his blast radius. Good job. Four. Okay. Yeah, yeah, so yeah. Many that's good. So yeah, many bullets. So many bullets. That's good. That's Unnecessary good. amounts of bullets. That's okay. Hey, Snarfy. Hey there, Snarfy. <laughs> Bitch, get out the sky! Oh, we got a we got a, a lady. lady, a ceiling lady. Boar. Real clinger on those ones. Yeah. I, I wish these. Uh, I wish these dungeons weren't so linear. Oh, bitch! I, I, I feel like we've been in this same. I, there's no variety. No, there's no variety at all in these dungeons. And the, and the first, first one, game there was had small, variety. Yeah, the first yeah. one, you were running from dudes. There was like guys chasing you. The first game this one's the was same. not scary, but it was kind of scary. And this game isn't anything. Oh, 
this game's barely a mystery. We basically figured it, like, most things itself. out. Yeah. Ow. Yeah, every time we had a mystery thing, I, I, I would love to know monetarily what, like, how long did this game take to make? How long, like, how much money did it cost? Is this like is a project there, swear he made just because he was like, I guess I'll make it. Is there a video game? Is there like an IMDB for video games that like shows budgets and who worked on things? I feel like this is something he had already like in the can and no one wanted. And then he got some like, you know, Nintendo probably signed him to a thing. And he was like, well, if, you, if I sign, you have to release this. Oh, I absolutely think that he's making a new game for the Switch and was able to parlay them releasing this game. Yeah. Especially because... Oh, Jesus. Yes! Yeah! Oh, my God. Well, that was loud. <laughs> Plus, there's going to be more guys. I know. I know. That's right. Yeah, we definitely need to research how this game got made. I need to ask, like, I need, I follow, Swery and I follow each other, so I need to, like, ask. And just be like, you gotta tell me how this game got made. Does he, uh, is he fluent in English? Um, kind of. He posts things in English every once in a while. Yeah, how do you ask in a nice way, like, what, what was the development like? Can you give me any insights into this process? Right? There's. It feels like there's something we're like clearly missing. It seems like it was a rushed game because there was like hype about it. And then a game appeared. Like people were talking about Deadly Premonition again because of the re-release on uh, Switch for like the super version. And then people bought it and there was some hype about it and then this came out oh i don't know maybe nintendo was like yo you you still got that thing though right and he's like yeah sure i do yeah and this was the thing that they slapped together yeah maybe more rubber bullets that's what i need more of the hell? Yo, find out if Sweary would sit down with us. Can we ask him questions? Can, would, does he want to talk about this game? I don't know. I don't know. From what he's said already, I mean, like, he has opinions on the game, but he also is like, this is the game I wanted to make, which I don't necessarily believe. Mm. Oh, you bitch. I love that she has Mardi Gras beads on. Again, it speaks to the weirdness of this game that it's not in New Orleans. I feel like they wanted it to be in New Orleans and couldn't get the rights to the name or something. Vor. What if we could get Sweary to do a movie show where we just talk about the bad movies in this game? Cat People, Go Ship. Oh my God, that'd be amazing. Do you think he actually likes those movies? Yes, I, I do. Th yes, I think those movies like meant something to him. Damn it, I did it again. I did it again. Good job. Ah, this sucks. Oh, oh, I can't. oh the, the, the locks, the lock friends are coming. Careful, be careful. Don't get, don't get it poisoned. Don't get a cold. <laughs> dodge this. Oh, okay. Hold on. There you go. Wait, dodge, dodge this. That? <laughs> I don't know.
Tokyo. I can't wait for the speedrunning community to get their hands on this gem. You know this is going to be at a game's done quick. Some guy's going to have found a bug because there definitely is one. There's definitely got to be some bugs. Glitch through walls and stuff like that. Absolute and fruit and lootly. If we can see in people's skulls, you got to be able to clip through doors. I don't know what you mean. <laughs> yes, you lied it. Yeah, 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 yeah. You'll get it. You'll get it. You'll find it. <laughs> what do you mean? Show me the buy balls. Show me them dry balls. Oh, come on. There's only certain angles I can see the eyeball. Yeah, we're getting close. <laughs> Damn it. Oh, well. It was worth a shot. Usually it works. Any chance that the, the penultimate mission in this game is like skipping stones or some shit? <laughs> like it, I mean, look, we already had that moment where it was like, skip these stones, buddy. Yeah. Oh, shit. Well, here we are. Ooh, I don't think we have anything else to upgrade, do we? No. More importantly, it's like, hey, um, you, you wouldn't be able to upgrade them anyway. Yeah. I guess maybe you could change your equipment, but we never, I don't think we have anything else oh maybe let's go look i don't think we have the power like we have we unlocked all we have right now that's the power of love right i only can do so many yeah okay so where is the bottom three are unlocked do you see that yeah maybe it's a different gun oh maybe it's a different shell oh saint germain can you my put normal anything? shells Great, so you got venom bullets on him now. I have venom bullets and I, yeah, okay. Interesting, neat. I never figured that out through the entire game. Not didn't hit me once. Skateboarding, we have that. No, we're fine. Mini game, we have that. Mm, doesn't help us. Concentration, we cannot unlock anything else. We're fine. Okay. This is great. This is great. It's Was there fine. A, a telephone in here? Yes. No. The game has tricked us, though. Every time I think there's going to be, like, we run into this stuff and then nothing happens. So it's like, okay, hopefully this is a boss fight. Final boss is a skateboard duel. Oh, I'm down. It'd I'm be down. awful. Uh, Elise! Elise! <clears throat> we, there was a big, there was um, demon dogs in the first game, like hellhounds. See, look, we literally went from one room to the next, and then we had to go through a mine dungeon. Yeah, okay. That's literally where we came from. <laughs> yeah. So dumb. All right. Uh, ooh, ladies. Right? What? Oh, shit. Well, hold on. There he is. Ladies. Ladies. Hey, lady. Hey, ladies. Okay, that is straight up just creepy, but like uh, well, in a sexy way. Yeah, that's a that's a, that's a creepy art show. Yeah, you know. Am I going to talk yeah. to this guy? Just shoot him. Nah, this is a boss fight, baby. Just shoot his ass. He, you were right, though, by the way. The bad guy did the same Avery thing that the guy did in the first one, where he goes Super Saiyan. Except this, yep. guy, this time he became this time, the dude from Umbrella Academy. Too. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. 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 Truth about just how special Lise was to you. They mentioned you. So many times, Mrs. Carpenter, Alexis, but I didn't catch on. I completely glossed over the monstrous karma you've accumulated. N doesn't make sense at all you why he would the be that. You together with Professor R's red soul, and you obeyed them, just as the goddess ordered. But then, the goddess died. You lost everything, and you went out of control. So, Professor R decided to give you something special. Lisa's body. You didn't steal the body. She gave it to you, didn't she? Great, then there's no crime. Let's all go home. Yeah, 
All right, then we're fine. Please don't please my goddess. No goddess. No, please. So sad. Being alone makes me sad. Dude, you would not have made it through 2020. It's a good thing we take you out in 2019, because 2010 would be a bad year for you, my man. <laughs> he would not have survived. He would he not would have, have survived. And, yeah. Jesse, what's happening? Okay. Trisha. Where's Patricia? I don't know. Patricia. Did they even animate an older version of her? Do you think they have an older like we're gonna see what she looks like as an adult? Patricia. Lisa and Patricia. How do you want to animate this scene, Swery? Animate? <laughs> He's just God looking for a roommate through stay at home. He knows it's going to get bad. With me. <laughs> How old is Lise right now when this happens? In her 20s? 15 yeah, Lise, years? Lise was 16 years old when she died. I was thinking of Patricia. Lise was 16 when she died. Patricia, I don't know how old she was, but she's in her 20s something now. Late we 20s. think we also think she's a tiny old person. So yeah. we, I don't know I what her like age is. I feel like we're going to see her and she's going to be like, "Hello, York." And she's going to look like a kid still. Oh, uh, see so lift up her shirt and is she on his shoulders. Master Blaster. I am Master. <laughs> he is Blaster. So we're going to have to fight this dude who will have some gimmick and then we have to fight a big 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 monster, right? It's I don't not know. It's too late for you, Avery. Turn yourself in. Stop now, and I'll even testify for you. Ah. Ah. That's right. It's not your fault. Not my fault. This game yes. is all butts. His shoulders look you like butts. Just being used. I was used. No! No one used me! I'm the guardian! What do you think he's listening I to right now? Uh, ABBA. Dancing queen! Oh, I thought it was Waterloo. Ooh! Is the, is the red gonna get on us? No, it's on getting, us a little bit. He's getting... Real Christian Bale face. Yeah, wow. All right, how do I kill this guy? Oh, shit! I bet we have to shoot him in the back or something. Or maybe you shoot his CD player. Ooh, careful! Yo, don't we have a dodge roll? No. We do have a run, though. Yo, the charge shot's so good. Yeah, I'm <laughs> this just gonna game keep is drinking singing. coffee. Yeah, 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 I'm gonna yeah. sit here, drink some coffee, blast his ass again. You got it. That's good for. That's good. I like that strategy. I, Patricia's my new goddess. My new lease. Get over it. Oh, Hulk smash! Hulk smash incoming. Oh, he's knocking up steam from the ground. New goddess, give me power. Fuck this guy. What a wonderful <laughs> joke of a fight! Oh, this is the third stage. 
Good night. Good night. Good night. Please. Please. I'm, a, I'm an FBI agent with a finger gun. Come on now. All right, Jesse, here's the reveal. What is it? Is she just... Oh, she is an adult. Oh, hey, girl. What's going on? Patricia. Oh, she dyed her hair. She's looking great. What the hell are you... Is he speaking in tongues? Matalos, Matalos, Bane, Bane, Matalos. <laughs> Kalima! <laughs> Kalima! <laughs> yeah, this is the big monster, I thought. But remember, don't shoot CLG. <laughs> Wait, so did she become a baby or did he become a baby? He's the baby. He became a baby? Yeah, that's his baby. I'm the baby! We doing this, huh? We going to the baby town, huh? Are we in the red room? Our red room? Is that her? You oh, no. Are they Who saying that? that his final form is a child? So that's your new altar. Sorry, but that religion won't last much longer. Patricia's coming with me. Do I have to fight him as a baby? As a you child? You have to fight as a little German boy. Oh, this sucks. Oh, oh! no! Uh, okay, so we have to shoot his CD player probably when he moves his hand. Oh, this is ass. Kid. Now shoot! Now, now we gotta shoot Kid. his player. Not yeah. the time. I was uh, no, this is what, what I was expecting. Okay. You, you weren't expecting a giant baby boy? No, I was not expecting little boy, baby boy. <laughs> I need you. If you only this. knew what I do to you, if I was that boy who's inside of you, <laughs> tiny boy, little boy, baby boy, I need you. <laughs> they oh, you are this kid. You are doing damage. That's so weird. So I can't target him. Okay. Yeah, I'm telling you, it's that CD player. Next time he claps his hands. It's also his dick, kind of. Yeah. That ain't fair. No, life ain't fair, kid. It was so weird. Did you shoot him, shoot him in the b hole? I think it's the CD player. Oh, he's throwing Woo! shit! He's throwing shit, Jesse! Can I shoot that? This is what a wonder. This is so wonderfully awful. <laughs> there you go. Right, yep, right in the donkers. His music! Oh, my Dancing tummy! Dancing queen! <laughs> Waterloo! I fought for you at Waterloo! Waterloo didn't end well. <laughs> it's not gonna end well for you either, little kid Avery Smith. Why does sometimes it do the thing and sometimes not? You wanna give him a big charge shot to the charge net to the, the charge, charge shots? shots? Don't do anything! Okay. Also, I think you're hitting the hitbox with the explosion from the bullet. Like, I don't think we've ever really found it. You're poisoning his, you're poisoning him. <laughs> All part of the plan. Blow it up. Shoot that CD player. One good hit will do, there we go. There we go. Uh, what happened to the top I, of that screen? You unlocked an achievement, I think. I don't want Something to happened. Die. Ooh, that's what they used to say in the first game. Yeah. I don't want to die. This is also very similar to a certain lady in the first game. Oh, shit. That's a hell of a way to go. Sorry. 
Mr. Stark. We gotta fight her, right? She's gotta be involved. You would think. But swear, look at his legs. Oh, this man. His legs are jiggling. I, the, the climax of this game was not as good as the first game. N no, not even remotely close. But I'm waiting for her to be like, welcome, father. Or something crazy. Something's going to happen. Yes. Patricia, you've become such a beautiful young woman. She's got a little firefly thing. <gasps> or dragonfly. Was she a ghost? <sighs> no. Did his hand go through her? No. Oh. He's dead. That's blood. That's blood juice. Why are you here? Yep. I didn't ask you to come here. What do you think you're doing? Yep. Here we I'm, go. Oh no, Jesse! Like some big hero? No. You never change. Always butting into people's problems. You wouldn't even let me die back then. What? Do you know how much pain I had to suffer because of you? Thanks to you, I had to live out 14 more years in hell. It's FK. But FK's been in her the entire time. Anyway? FK's been in her the entire die. time. I could never do that. I could never just stand there and let you die. And only never. by dying could FK be reborn. Never. That doesn't make but any sense, though. No, no, no. That doesn't make any sense. FK was around. Yeah, it doesn't make any sense. Stop. Stop it. No, I won't. Maybe York is going to come out to protect him? Towering mountain of corpses. No. Yes, you did. You're possessed by death. No, I'm not. I did it for the sake of justice. Is that why you let her die? For Ooh, don't bring up Naomi Watts. Don't say her name. Don't say Please. Naomi Watts. Don't do it. Do, just don't say her name. Emily. Why? No! Oh, the fairy! No, the fairy! Emily. Why? <laughs> oh, damn it. Damn it. Damn it. I couldn't protect her. Yet I survived. How does she know I about Emily, though? To accomplish nothing. Damn it, York. Please. Just take me. Take me to the other side. <laughs> show, me his show me his face. Uh, York? No. Oh. It's me, Zach. Kason. Oh, don't give me that look, Zach. <laughs> I'm awful sorry I'm not York. But I can still save you. I could even take you over to the other side, if that's what you really want. Come on, give me your hand, old buddy. I'll lead you to where you need to go. Just like a this is a trap that guide ships through the dark abyssal night. I have no other option. You have no other option. Give him your hand. Get out of town with this. I have no other option. That's so. Give him your hand, up. Jesse. Give him your hand. How is this? Did we screw up in some way? All right. No, we didn't screw up, Jesse. I've been here for all of it. This is fine. We're doing it. We screwed up. Why is everything red? We we ruined. Oh no, this is what I thought. We have to have a fight with FK. Yeah. Wait it out. Uh. <laughs> yeah. 
<gasps> the tree! Did we become a tree? I We're think a tree? We became a tree. Yo! Wild! To be fair, that makes sense. Our hand was a tree gun. Is it like you failed? Oh, Whoa! Welcome, Zack, to the red world. You become such a fine monster. Oh, oh, oh. Lena and George could never hold a candle to you. They really disappointed me, you know? Especially Lena. <laughs> I can't believe she actually tried to outwit me right at the very end. See, my plan was to have Patricia die. Then let Ken Oh, no, what? <laughs> Wait, what? What happened? He had a plan. Stop right there. Oh, no. You gotta kill us. Is that you, Morgan? A xenomorph tree. That tree is so cool. He doesn't know. Don't move another muscle. Francis Zack Morgan. Your story, your reasoning. I accept most of it. So just put your hands down and give it up. I'll take it from here. Yeah. FK's inside of him. Oh no. Hey. She ain't half bad. She can't see this world, but. She still managed to find her way here using nothing but her nose. She's like a genius pianist who can play Chopin without looking at any sheet music. <laughs> She's got potential. Isn't that right, Zack? Ooh, I just got a nugget of an idea. I know the perfect way to use her. What the shit is... So we're Aaliyah. Oh, Jesse, don't mess around with this. Okay, go right to the good items. Okay, one in the middle. Um, okay. What? No, that was the wrong one. To the left. FK. Hate pig. Great. Aaliyah. Oh, there's another way. There's we gotta look behind too. Left. Eyeballs. Nothing. I, nothing? Left. I'm going. Eyeballs. Oh, the it was middle this. one. Yeah. It was, yeah. whole game was leading up to that moment, FYI. All of our investigations was our eyeballs to be used there. Yo, we're Okra Boy. We are the Okra now. Whoa, we are the superhero Okra Boy. <laughs> Listen, that design of the tree monster is really cool. Stop, get away from her. No. Woo! Light him up, baby. Oh. You're Zach? Special Agent Zack? She only knows York. Is that the... Correct. You came to save me. Didn't you? Hey, Patricia. You've grown so much. So FK was you in Patricia? your hair color? 
for a hot yes. sec, like he was pretending. Like he, I think he's more idea. inside of him. Like he's more inside of Morgan than her. Like everything that he was seeing, because there was the whole scene where he was with him back in the <sighs> thing too. And so there was a tree inside Good. of us. Good. I don't think there was a tree inside of us. I just think that it looks like when we killed FK, he became a part of us. <laughs> Zach. Like a Horcrux. Kind of. don't have much time left. I'm just glad I got to see how much you've grown <laughs> before it all ends. What are you saying? Don't be stupid. Don't worry. When I die, so will this tragedy. Because it's I part of him. I it would. He and I. Two sides of the same coin. Yeah, from right. the beginning, because he created We've him. Always been. He's the boy who got away. If I disappear, so will he. You don't need to worry, Patricia. You can be happy now. No, you're not allowed to do that. The contract's still in effect here. Look at this. Was this all a big lie? I promise to protect you from all the evil in our world. You need to uphold the contract. Zack, you saved my life. You're the only reason I'm alive right now. That one time when I wouldn't stop crying. Remember what you said? Our world is filled with pain. Evil, violence, betrayal, jealousy, lies. Unseen despair is always waiting for a chance to paralyze us. Sometimes you might feel like you'd be better off dead. But you can't give up. Never forget. Your life is your own. Those words freed me from the chains of my destiny. If it weren't for you, <coughs> Symbolism. I would have died a long time ago. Please, Zack. I still need this contract. Please keep protecting me. You're legally obligated. Morgan, get away from her! Whoa. Oh no! We Wait, gotta fight her! Understanding. Get away before I count to three. Too oh, late. Shoot. Got her. Gotcha. No! Listen to me. Two. He's gonna take the bullet for her and kill FK with him. Three. Yes. And FK is going to be like, the fuck? Oh, what if Patricia takes the bullet? No way. No way. It no bounces way. off the locket. It hits the locket, <laughs> bounces off, reflects into Aaliyah. Everyone dies. Last scene we of could... Hamlet. They're all dead. Shut up. I Shut knew up. it! I fucking <laughs> knew it! Yes! <laughs> yes! <laughs> yes. Oh, God. <laughs> Ding! <laughs> oh, shit! No! Yeah. I, don't know what to say. <laughs> I got you, buddy. Don't worry about it. Yeah. He came You've through! Quite the crybaby since I last saw you, Zach. He just matrixed the shit out of this! So York is like a timeless being. Hi there. York Good is like, what up, again, baby? <laughs> she doesn't know who he is. Because she, yeah. York Morgan. Because Zach was always in her head. Call me or, York. He was, you know. Everyone calls me. Yeah. She only saw the white haired guy. York? Oh, that's right. Because everyone, I always forget about that. Yes, that's right. Yeah. I'm Zach, and Zach is me. Yeah, so she only saw Zach, the white-haired guy. She never saw York, ever. Yeah, no one... Yeah. Uh. <laughs> He's like, hey, girl. <laughs> <laughs> Look at my weird, scrawny body. I've always known about you two. What are you? Incredible. We're your old friends, Patty. Now and forever. 
If the game just ended here, I'd be fine. If that was it, if it was never like addressed at all, end the end. Yeah, pal. He ages. He he gains the cancer is gone. He gains five more years. What does he look like? The gray haired one. He's gone. Oh shit! Did he just become who? Jesse, they've become a perfect being. Did he fusion dance? Oh, Yo, oh shit! <laughs> Yo, baby, we back. All right, who are we supposed to shoot? FK? Yeah, I think so. Aim carefully. Oh, don't shoot Aaliyah. Aim carefully. Sister. Okay, yeah, you see Aaliyah has a health bar. Um, we don't want to shoot her. Aim carefully, sister. <laughs> Aim carefully, sister. Freeze! I can wait. Take flight, you son of a bitch. Aim carefully, sister. Incredible. This is so silly. FK is like the Baron Harkonnen. He's flying all over the place. Yeah, FK's a little creepo. Uh. What? It's the promise! Uh, the B, the B, the B! Press the B! I pressed B. <gasps> oh, careful. shit! Freeze. Yo, and we made it to a banger song. I can't believe this is a thing song. with this guy. This is the most <laughs> FK fight I've ever seen in my life. <laughs> him flappy birding yes, all him over flappy the place. Birding. Patricia Clarkson, I'm here to save you. Oh, is she possessed? Yeah. One, two, three. Ah! All right, let's do this. This music. Sweary, you know what? At, at first I was like, what are you doing, Sweary? Now I'm in times a billion. Boom, 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 boom. Carefully, sister. Demon be gone! I'm warning you. Yo, now I want other games with, y with York in other people. Like other dimensions of York. Ooh, careful. The blood obscures your vision. Oh, I see that. Uh-oh. Scene. Even these, even these timed events are silly. <laughs> <laughs> Got him! Look at his little dance! Yeah. <laughs> yeah. They didn't even, boy. like, really take Woo! his sprite and do anything with it. Oh, it's just ass. slapping. <laughs> She hit me with the resistance as futile? Hell yeah, bro. Lady. Lady. She's a big Star Trek Lady. fan. Lady. Execution! Lady! Execution! Oh, Lady! You're out of, you're out of uh, eyeball juice. Hell no, I'm not. You are the suspect, Morgan. You're on death row. And it's time for your execution! <laughs> Yo, this heal. is just... Do you want to use all your yeah, items? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> they gave us all those items for a reason. Let's, yeah, it was let's like, use execution. Everything. All right, <laughs> enjoy. Okay, okay. Execution. You are the suspect, Morgan. You're on death row. Resistance. You could shoot her. We we were good. You didn't get her too many times. Oh, my power. Oh, my power. I promise, bitch. Great. Oh. Super fun. Oh, now he's going to get judgment. Oh, my God. Hi there. I Welcome to my you. red. I thought that was you whistling, but it's him coming for him. Oh, my God. You're going to get it now. <laughs> oh, you're going to get it, boy. You're going to get it now. He's slow whistling on your ass. Oh no! All my There's plans and machinations. That's a bullet coming. Oh, Inception. Oh, it's like it's like yeah. Plans within plans. Uh oh, uh oh. We're speeding up. We're speeding up. We're speeding up. We're speeding up. Am I just a loser? <laughs> <laughs> Are you telling me I'm actually kind of pathetic?
Got him. Dead. We explode. Yeah, exploded your heart with mind bullets, bro. Red tree! <laughs> Got him. All that was left was an eyeball. Squish it. Between your toes. Huh. Zach! Hey, Zach! Wake up! Zach! No! You can't die here! Please, Zach! York, please! Save There's Zach. nothing I can do. I know you can save him! Death is inevitable, Patricia. It descends upon us all equally. All life dies in the end, and no one can change that. Arnold S. said but that. We're finally together again! This Yo, is final line oh. of the game is York this saying, is I'll be back, so, FYI. This is an extenuating circumstance. Then, sign a new one with me! This contract isn't valid anymore. Now, I'm going to protect you from all the evil in the world. And I plan on keeping my promise. So you're not allowed to die before I do. Go on, sign the contract! Come on, sign it! Now! Are you sure you're prepared for everything that entails? You can only break the rules once. Like he did, right? This is him breaking the rules. Is he going to be inside her head now? Yo, I think CLG is the new lead of this franchise. This is the forest. This is where the goddesses live. Yeah, this is the weird goddess forest. When Zack wakes up, I want you to tell him something. This is our final farewell. Thank you so much for all you've done. Over all those years, you never forgot about me, did you? It's been so long since we've seen each other, but I know you always kept me in your heart. That's what kept me alive. I owe it all to you, Zach. Thank you. Is he straight up a guardian angel god? Goodbye. I don't know. <laughs> So now Zach's going to come alive again? All right, come on, switch. Load it up. Come on. Not now. Come on. <laughs> John Cena? <laughs> hey, you don't see him. Is someone in her brain? The Sot Rouge. Thank you. Thank you, York. Thank you. Thank you. I don't. What are you thanking him for? What happened? He who fights with monsters should see to it that he himself does not become a monster. Oh, Nietzsche. And if you gaze long into an abyss... Oh, Nietzsche. ...the abyss also gazes into you. So is York just the abyss? York, like, became what he was trying to fight the entire time, I guess, is the point. No, Zack did. Oh, yeah. York was a spirit man who went off to go spend his life with Emily in a forest somewhere. <laughs> in, the, in, the, in the beautiful soul forest. Yeah, actually, they were in a diner, too, I think. They went to the diner where all the ladies in red showed up. Yo, cue the whistle song. Oh, we're in Morocco. No, uh, crypt. No, that is a crypt. Oh, in the with the creepy guy. The Clarkson crypt. Those are all the guards. Hey, that one guy made it. Good for him. <laughs> Good for that guy. Knife guy lived. Wow. <laughs> you know I what? can't believe Knife guy made it. Much yeah. blood was shed, and many precious lives were lost. Oh shit! The song Avery "Deep Smith in the Deep South" on eleven charges, including kidnapping Patricia Clarkson, illegally disposing of Lise Clarkson's corpse, and distributing the illegal substance known as San Rouge. He's currently serving a term of 381 years at a state prison in Angola, Louisiana. His first possible scheduled review for parole could happen in 127 years at the earliest. 
Aaliyah Davis's assistance in solving the case was officially acknowledged, and she was transferred to the DCHQ. Thanks to Boston Chief Robert Abraham's support, she was officially allowed to join the Saint Rouge Investigative Task Force. Later, it was reported that her younger brother began to show small signs of recovery from his addiction. Simon Jones was finally freed from this is the best worst ending to a video game agent, and returned to the Boston branch. He was given a brand new computer and put back on data analysis, but never worked another big case. Instead, he spends most of his time at the office doing Sudoku. He got and what so, he wanted. After 14 long Isn't this years, how the Sandlot the ends? Case <laughs> was finally closed. Lucare still suffers from the aftermath of the plan set into motion by Professor R, a.k.a. Helena Doman. She was clearly smart enough to restore the Clarkson's empire on her own, yet she never tried to. The true reason behind her tragic downfall remains shrouded in mystery. A person's life can be greatly affected by the tiniest of anomalies, such as buttoning the wrong shirt button. Just like how this genius, who once inspired great expectations, went on to become infamous as one of the South's most inhuman criminals. And now, after a very long time, life is finally starting to return to Lucare. Alright, I have no idea what happened to him, though. There has to be a post-credit, right? Like, it doesn't make sense. I Jesse, almost want to go I back because... so many questions. That one scene cut out. I almost want to go back and replay just for that. I'd have to do that boss fight again, but I think I could do that in a heartbeat. There's got to be a post-credit scene. Absolutely. There also has to be. We saw the last red letter in Swery's name, so I wonder if the red letters do spell something out. Maybe, but also, I was told that it's also a uh, uh, Japanese thing to like include a red letter in horror games just cause. And like horror things, so I don't know, I have no clue. And? Oh, I thought I was gonna say Jesse Cox. Good job, Maylee. What about the voice for York? Why didn't why, you get a why shout is the, out? Why are the credits like uh, Lord of the Rings? Where it's yeah, like why, why the is white that the tree, tree of Gondor. <laughs> Z-I-R. This is nothing. This is all their late. This is what you were asking for earlier. Yeah, I think so. I don't think Seed. any of these. Dios P. Het. <laughs> th 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 yeah, I don't think so. Supran try. Yucker. It doesn't work. It didn't work. We got it. Yeah, you nailed it. Jesse, we're. Uh, I mean, we're going to get to talk about it, but like, holy, holy shit, man. What happened? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, dude. Holy shit is a whole experience here. Holy shit is exactly... I don't know. Oh, here's the drama unit. The drama unit. The New Orleans crew. Did they go and film on location? Dan Luffy, we have some questions about the English Dan, localization of this yeah. game. Could you maybe get in a conference call with us real quick? Yeah, Dan, do you have any thoughts? Uh, let's bring in the language QA people as well. Public relations, why don't you get in here as well? Bang Zoom Entertainment. Maverick recorded and mixed it. Oh, 
a tease music. Tease music. Genji K Goda did the best work in the entire game. The opening cinematic's fantastic. Is it saying you want to continue? Is that what it's saying? Maybe. Let's continue. It definitely sounds French, but I could be wrong. It says life goes on. Oh, that's very sweet. Oh, the leaves are turning red. Oh, over time. Yeah, interesting. Do, 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 do. Oh, yeah, look at that. Fascinating. That's the deep song right there. South. The Deep South is the fucking song. Ending theme. Portant la vie continue. They were saying continue. Performed by the band Sublime? What? It says Sublime. They don't practice Santeria. They don't got <laughs> no crystal ball. Listen, if I had a million dollars, I would spend it all. I love that the leaves are turning red. I don't know what this means, but I'm in. It's going to go to a load screen at the end of this. That's what it's going to lead to. Oh, I'm so excited for that. All the other people are leaving the theater right now, but we're still sitting eating our popcorn. Yeah, we're waiting. We, know, we, are, we, we, know. Are, we are the smart people waiting in the directed by Swery. Yep. Swery is... I love Swery. Swery takes big swings. Swery takes huge swings. <laughs> the, the L is a two! The L is... The L is a two?! Dead, dead to eat. <laughs> <laughs> I love it. Okay, here we show go. Show us something. Give us something wild. Yep, there's the phone. The fuck? <gasps> I stole this from Professor R's lab. He's alive. <laughs> I figured you would. Yeah. I've read through it dozens of times, but it still doesn't make sense to me. I mean, at some point, her plan started to collapse, right? Otherwise, I probably would have been killed early on. But here I am, alive and breathing. And the stalker who harassed me for years has been arrested, too. Not only that, but now I have a brand new life waiting for me as heir to the Clarkson Empire. Both Lucare and the Clarkson's industries are finally showing signs of recovering. It's just uh, hard for me to believe that this all went according to her plan. Yes, I understand how you feel. No matter how you look at it, things couldn't possibly have ended up perfectly in accordance with her plan. Oh my God, I what's about sure to happen? Maybe you York cleared his cancer? Through the effort you put into it. That's it what it's saying, wasn't yes. It something that Lena gave to you. You made this life possible. You didn't do it all on your own, of course. You were only able to come this far thanks to everyone who supported you along the way. Could anyone really believe that Lena was the one who orchestrated all this? There's no way. I'm positive. All the people you've met thus far and all the things you've experienced created the person you are now. Lena's just one of those people and nothing more. You really think so? Still, York and I both fell for that message of hers. Maybe her plan really is still moving forward after all. Stop joking around. I'm seriously concerned about this. <laughs> Sorry, Patty. <laughs> <laughs> what am I going to do with you, Zach? <laughs> By the way, did you change your hair color back in order to signify some important decision you made? <sighs> yeah. I guess I did. After losing everything, I finally found my true self. So I've decided to accept everything that comes to me from this point on. I think that color looks great on you. Really? Thanks, Zach. <laughs> I'll never give up. I'm determined to overcome my cursed blood. 
Whatever it takes. And you will. That's why York chose you to be his assistant, you know. He always knew you had it in you. Wow. Well, he really thought that highly of me? Suddenly I feel really motivated now. This is crazy. I don't even know what I should get started with first. Now that's the Patricia Clarkson I know. Oh, I got it. I want to go and get one of Alexis's chocolate sundaes. Not a bad idea. They are to die for. Yeah, they're like the deadly premonition of ice cream. <laughs> <laughs> Shut up! Shut up! <laughs> deadly premonition, yeah. LOL. Well, so long, Zach. I'll come visit you next summer. Louisiana summers are just too hot for me to handle. Plus, I'm a billionaire. You're always welcome here. Is Zach texting with York? Yes, that's the implication. But where is he? Oh shit, do you see the screen? It's the dog, is he FK? No, and the thing is us. What do you mean? Tell E I said hi, Emily. Is he texting with him in the afterlife? Jesse, I can see your face in the dog's face. That's Zach. Why would he have FK's dog, though? <gasps> His fairy. Why would he have FK's dog, though? So the red tree, Feels he like didn't have cancer. It was a red tree in him, because then it now, sprouted. Time for some coffee. No matter what the plan is, Coffee should always come first. He's Isn't not wrong, right, Emily. I'm the fairy. Dude, still high as a kite. If Emily is just alive, bowling. He got a strike. Nope, spare. Wait, we never got answers for this guy! Who's Huda? Is Huda Man the naked guy? We never got answers for him. Not one answer. <laughs> what does that mean? Who was he? Why? I have so many questions. Was who he the was blessing he? in disguise? That doesn't make any sense. Who was he, though? He guided us on the entire story mission, and we never found an answer. Ever. Period. Who was the jazz guy? All right. Let's see what happens here. Oh! Oh! Only took us 345 hours, but we killed it. Did it. Do we get a special S rank bonus ending? Is there another? Let me save here under episode one when I had $600. We got so much money. Just in case. Because I want to like, I don't know. Boop, boop, boop. So there's a new photo. And we're still smoking weed. All right. Let me just get this straight. The places of power were never explained. I don't think we're I don't think we're done with the game. What happens if you load the file that we just saved? I don't I just don't know. You have a a red leaf. So where do we go back? Do we just replay the last mission? I don't know. I guess the red leaf is new game plus. Did we actually beat the game? I assume so. Do we have to beat it a second time? I don't think so. Jesse, I the, we like no I like know some things about the story, but I don't know a bunch of other things. Let me let me do a thing. <laughs> let me do a thing for us cuz I care. This is right before the final battle, right? I don't think we missed anything in that line. Uh, I, I want to I, I wanna just take a hot sec just to... I, I feel terrible because I should be right now. I... Uh, hold on. 
Do you have to go do... Do you have to go... Oh no, do you gotta go stream? Is it time is it time for you to do are you dungeon mastering? What do you gotta uh, go? No no no. Uh I, I wanna play with Dodger and uh uh Octopimp, a game that I promised them to play at one. It's one twenty eight. <laughs> I just need this answer! And they have to understand. I love them. They have to understand. Go I hope they're play. watching right now. Guys, come in the chat. Dodger, where are you? Dodger I hope Octo, you understand. You? I need this answer. I need this answer. Octo, Dodger, I need this answer. Everyone tell Octo and Dodger I love them. I love them so much. Where They're my you? favorite people in the world, but I need this answer. I have to have it. Where are you, everybody? Uh, Dodger, where are you? Come here, Dodger. Come to me. All right, we're going to just quickly zip through this. Quickly zip through this. Yeah, good try. You can tweet at them. That's fine. <laughs> yeah, let them know. Wait, you got to do this two parts, right? Because you got to get through this one. Yeah, 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 yeah. I'm just going to skip. I'm going to skip. Hold A. Holding. All right. Let's shoot this guy in the damn face because he sucks. Yeah. No charges. Skinny. Gonna spot you. Not a map. Not a map. Oh, look at that. The map works, though. Well, that's nice. Uh, there's only one thing I need to see. I'm not, like, concerned about anything else except this one thing, because I goofed. And I feel bad. All right. Yeah, no, I get it, dude. Yeah, no. Cool. This guy is a second time around. This guy's a bitch. Gonna crush your bones. I got it. All right. What skip, happened? skip, 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 skip. He has to grow big. Oh, I know. No. Where was the line? Was it? Was it? It's when we are. It's when we're the tree man. All right, this is so nonsensical. Why does... You got to charge up your gun, and then when he swipes at you, I think we shoot the CD player. Are you sure? Because that's not what happened before. Okay, I just remember... Because charging does can't... nothing. Oh, See? okay. All right, then just shoot his junk. There we go. That's good. That's good. That's good. 45, 45, 45, 45, 45, 45. Three. Yeah, he's going to go throw barrels at me now. With his Pokeball CD player. Yeah. If I could shoot the barrels, but I can't. Kid, you suck. Right in the bean bag. That barrel's rolling back to him. That seems like a problem. Why won't it work? This is just like the Stay Puff Marshmallow fight. That one corner is the one that works? Why is hitting that part of his body? Oh my ass. Also, I feel terrible that the case is pinned on this kid. Right. Right? Like, all these terrible people, and they pin it on this guy, and he gets, like, 300 years in jail? That's terrible. Yeah, he obviously has... Like, he's obviously being used, even though he's yeah, like... Even though he's like, I'm not used! He obviously is being used. 
Yeah, I feel like there's a problem with the criminal justice system, and maybe someone should look into it. Take that, Sony Dual Skip CD player. How does... There we go. I was about to say, how does none of these do the exact same damage? Shot him in the leg. Screen, screen went black. I did that again. I Why? I think die. it's just a bug. Also, he's not bad. I agree. He's not bad. Okay. Let's do this. All right. We'll walk towards her. We'll get... So, I think what happens in this scene is that we think we're going to go see Patricia. But because we're still in, like, the weird twisted world, it's FK just communicating through her like he does with uh, um, Aaliyah. Okay, that makes she's sense. she's actually still passed out. <sighs> All right, so I'm going to fast forward this. Patricia, you've been... This is the scene, I think, where we become a tree. No, I don't... I think we have to become a tree here. <laughs> oh, makes, are you going to do... Which makes no sense why we have to become a tree here. <laughs> It is the load screen. That's wild. Yeah, why do we... Is this us giving in to the evil? Yeah, we reached out and grabbed his hand. It didn't... We skipped the cutscene. It wasn't... We didn't even have a choice. All right, this is what I want to see. He, when he talks to us, it cut him off before. Because I was moving forward and I thought I had more time. To the red world. You become such a fine monster. Oh, oh, oh. Lena and George could never hold a candle to you. They really disappointed me, you know? Especially Lena. <laughs> I can't believe she actually tried to outwit me right at the very end. So Lena's plan was See, to betray my him then. plan was to have Patricia die. Then let Candy and Melvin survive. That's what we thought originally, the right? Of fertility and her hubby, the Great King, working together to turn the entire South into the Red Kingdom. <laughs> Yet right at the last minute, who appeared but York? That little rat. He saved Patricia. Then both the goddess of fertility and the great king died. I mean, we kind of deduced this by ourselves. That little journal she right. behind made all my hard work go to waste. But, Zack, I see now that you are well worth all the years of hard work I put into you. <laughs> the results are truly marvelous. Like the finest bourbon, matured after long years of patience. By the way, did my letters make you cry? He sent him the letters? What? This is so much to miss for moving forward! Don't tell me. You actually thought Patricia sent all these? <laughs> so he was sending the letters to make us come back? <laughs> yes. Ah. <laughs> uh. She was too busy for any of that. Yeah, she was you running a, a giant business. The precious time on you? <laughs> What's wrong? Can't hear me anymore? <laughs> well, that's fine by me, Zach. Especially now that York's out of the picture. Oh, this no adds so much more to the ending. Anymore. Now, hurry up and destroy Patricia. Make flowers for me. Blood, red, flowers. So he oh. wants you, because FK doesn't have a physical body anymore, he wants you to do to her what he did to all the women in the first one. Like, he's going to use you. Because this world we're in, the big tree monster we are, we're not that in reality. Like, when Aaliyah shows up, Aaliyah doesn't see us as the tree monster. She just sees us as us trying to, like, grab Patricia. So this is all in the other world. This is all happening in the other world time area. 
Yeah, so you know like when it faded after after the thing ended and it fades out and uh you know Avery's still on the ground and then they can yeah. send Avery to jail even though we shot him twice in two battles? Yeah. That's the reason why. And so Aaliyah, uh like all this is just in our head, and so in reality, we're trying to like I don't know, stick seeds inside Patricia. Still got lots of other questions. Still Tons have of lots questions. of other questions, Many Jesse. Many questions. Yeah. Um there's a lot that isn't explained for sure. I'm gonna. Does anyone know who Hoonan is? Anyone? I have no clue. Well, listen. We obviously are gonna have to ruminate on this before we do the episode. Uh, we'll find out if there's any more to stream. If not, I guess we did it, Jesse. Hooray! I'm like, once again, just like in our Deadly Premonition one video. I'm glad I played it. I don't know how I could possibly be like, everyone out there, you should play this game. <laughs> like, I don't. I'm glad yep. I experienced it, but I have no idea how I could recommend it. Agreed. And it's another situation where it's like, yeah, we got some answers to the story, but who was the voodoo guy? What What is the What is the answer to any of those questions? Like, like, people in chat are like, well, here's who he is. But that doesn't explain why he's involved and why he guided you. But why is he similar to FK? Like, that doesn't make any sense, chat. I, 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 very weird, very weird game. Yeah, he's just sort of there. And he, like, from the beginning guides you, but there's no reason why he, what does he get out of it? Why is he in the final, why is he, like, in the end? Was the old lady Huda Man? I don't, was the old lady? Was that the whole point? Is the old lady was supposed to, I don't know. That she was the bowler, that's why they couldn't convert her to Christianity? Huda Man because literally she just means Voodoo Priest. Okay, but why does Voodoo Priest want to get involved? Right, like, obviously otherworldly beings are being channeled here, but what is the point of Voodoo Man? And is Zack, I'm sorry, is York then a Voodoo Man as well? Was that her hubby? I don't know. I don't know. Chat, yeah, we need to think about this. We need to take down notes and, like, this will be a hell of an episode. All right, anyway. Go, go play video <laughs> games with our other friends. Go play with them. All right, I'm going to go harass them. Thank you all. Uh, sit tight. You can stare at this screen while I go find... Uh, Octo and Dodger, and we can get real weird with it. All right. Thank Jesse, you, I'll Santel. talk to you. No problem. I'll talk to you later. We'll probably have some thoughts and feelings on this. We will you certainly know. have thoughts and feelings. All right. Bye, dude. Have a good day. Goodbye, everybody. Goodbye. Goodbye. Thanks, goodbye, everybody. Goodbye. 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 goodbye.